membership milestones. I'll go back through and read them all. Hi, everyone. Welcome in, welcome in. I hope you're doing so good. Yes. Yes. I can't even say it. <laughs> I can't even say it. Um, yes, we um, over here in this channel in the corner um, hit 10,000 subscribers. I, <laughs> I just, <laughs> I, unexpected, not thinking this would happen anytime soon. I was saying my unrealistic goal for the year was to hit 10K by my birthday, which is April 21st. So that is still a whole month away. Um, <laughs> and I thought that was gonna be steep. And I was like, let me not even like, you know, count on that too much. Um, and then last week, somebody said, Someone was like, YouTube, why? Why? Frozen in time? Refresh. I don't know why. Well, I don't know why. 10K broke the stream. Why? <laughs> YouTube hated all the milestones. Let me just check my stuff really quick. Nope. The bitrate is fine. I have no idea, guys. Why? I just want to stream. I didn't do anything. All my settings are right. I think it's her internet. It's not my, it's not my internet. Can anyone hear me or no? <laughs> Am I talking to myself or can anyone hear me? It's fine now? Okay, cool. I'm going to just keep talking. Just refresh the stream and let's hope for the best. I know other people were having, oh my God. Yeah, half of our people are gone. The heck? I don't even have anything open. I don't have anything going on. Oh, we're getting a raid too. <laughs> oh no, not us getting a raid right now. Oops. <laughs> Guri Dune, welcome in. I hope the stream continues to happen. <laughs> I hope the stream continues to happen as the raiders come in. Welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hello? Guri Dune, welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing so good. Thank you for the raid. You're coming in right at the beginning. I hope the stream is fine. It doesn't look like it is because there's uh, no one watching. <laughs> uh, it doesn't look like it is because it looks like there's no one here anymore. I don't know what to do. All my settings are fine. All my settings are fine, so I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna sit here and talk anyway and then hope that YouTube gets with it, okay? <laughs> But how are you, Lauren? I hope you're doing good. Thank you for the raid. I appreciate it so, so much. Yeah, like it literally just started a second ago. Like literally just started a second ago. So welcome and welcome in. Hope you're doing so good. Um, yeah, okay. Anyway, uh, like I was saying, <laughs> um, uh, we hit 10K. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I so badly wanted it to happen on stream, but it, let's pretend we just noticed now. Let's pretend we just noticed now. Oh my God, we did it. Ah! <laughs> um, th thank you all so, so much. In case you didn't already read my post I, that I made, I will say everything that I've said there. Ah, and there are so many of you super chatting. Oh my God, my God. I have to go back and read them all. Thank you all so, so much. I'll go back from the beginning and read them all. Um, God, guys. Um, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I started this YouTube channel over a year ago now. I started posting consistently a little bit over a year ago, a year and like a couple months. And when I started my channel, I started it as a way to get out of a really funky time and try and find more joy in my life and make friends. And I never had the, um, <laughs> uh, I never had the, thought that people would actually watch the channel. <laughs> um, I know like people say that, they're like, well, I didn't think anyone would watch, but like they go and like they go into it and they're like, yeah, I'm gonna get this many subscribers. I genuinely was like, I'm gonna post these videos and no one's gonna watch them, but I'm gonna have a good time. Um, and then and then people started to watch them and, and have continued to watch them. And I cannot even fathom 10K and I just, literally don't this is my like oscar acceptance speech i'm not prepared um thank you so much 
it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, I have loved making all of these streams, making all the videos, making all the shorts. So whether you came here through a video, a short, a stream, or someone else telling you to subscribe, I'm just glad you're here. And thank you for being cuckoo and chaotic with me and all the love. And I don't have any more goals after this. Um, <laughs> I don't I don't have any more goals. Um, maybe at some point I will. Maybe at some point I'll be like, yeah, let's get to blah, blah, blah. I don't have any goals. This was my crazy wildest dream goal. Um, and it happened. So thank you so much. We will be having a 10K celebration. However, however, um, I didn't anticipate this happening this week. So the 10K celebration is going to be next week because I don't uh, have a day off that I can do a long stream and I want to do a long celebration stream for it. So stay tuned for that next week. All right, let me go back and say, let me read everyone's stuff because you all super chatted and stuff while the loading screen was on. So hold on, let me go back and see what I missed. Cursed, thank you for the 10. $10 Roonies for 10K subs. Subbies, you so deserve this. Thank you so much. And a big shout out to my mods. I literally couldn't exist without you guys. So thank you so much. Love you, Cursed. And Mina, thank you for being a member for five months. Congrats on 10K. Thank you so much, Mina. I appreciate it. And Louise, thank you for being a member for nine months. Congrats on 10K. Been here since right before 1K. Let's go. Let's go. It's so long ago now. And Caroline, thank you so much. Congrats on 10K, so well-deserved. So happy to be a member and to be able to support your channel. Your streams always put me in a better mood, so thank you. Caroline, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Please, all the hearts and hypes for everybody. And Bailey, thank you for being a member for 10 months. Yay, 10 months and 10K in the same week. Love you so much, Pay. You deserve everything and more that you have worked and will continue to work toward. What if I just quit? <laughs> what if I was like, yeah, this was my goal. Goodbye, channel's done channel's done never doing it again no I'm kidding imagine I was like yeah this was my social experiment to see if I could get 10,000 subscribers and now I'm gonna just leave no I'm kidding <laughs> I'm kidding I'm kidding um Jess thank you for being a member for eight months happy 10k so happy for you and the community you've built thank you so much hipster girl thanks for the 499 congrats on 10k pay thank you so much Emily, thanks for the 10, 10K hype. Let's go, congrats, thank you so much. Michelle, thank you for the 1999. Congrats on 10K, thank you so much. Krista, thank you for being a member for four months. Congrats on 10K, thank you so much. Ella, member for two months, congrats on 10K. We can finally say it, I can't believe it. We inched our way super fast. We inched our way super, super fast. <laughs> um, and Caroline, thank you for being a member for 11 months. 11 months, so glad I found your channel. Thank you for the great content and streams. Thank you so much. Lorraine, thank you for being a member for nine months. You guys are crazy. Thank you so much. <laughs> 10K, let's go. Kaylee, thank you for being a member for three months. 10K, let's go, so deserved. Thank you so, so much. Okay, I'm almost there. Um, Nate, congrats. Thank you so much for the two. Did you know before my DM? I did. Um, I was out, though, um, on a date with my boyfriend. And I, when I went to the bathroom at the restaurant, I was four subscribers away. So I told myself that I wasn't gonna check again until I got home because I had, I had anticipated hitting the 10K after that. So I was like, let me have this moment not in a public restroom and let me check it when I get home. Um, but my boyfriend checked in, he like made a little face. So I, I knew, I knew for a little bit until I actually got to go home and was like, I got to look at it and have my little moment and, you know, be super grateful and look back at some of my old stuff and all that. Um, but thank you all for letting me know. <laughs> it was so funny. There were so many people DMing me, like, because I hadn't made a post yet. And I was like, oh, I promise. Like, I swear. I promise I know. I promise I like some people were like, you did you do you know you hit 10K? And I was like, I know, I know. I just don't want to jinx it yet and have everyone unsubscribe. <laughs> so I waited for a little bit. Heather, thank you for being a member for six months. Congrats. Thank you so much. Kuri Doon, thank you for being a member for six months. 10K hype for the lovely Peyton. All the love to you. All the love to you as well. Thank you so much. Nikki, thank you. For oh my God, there's guys. You got all, all of you saved your milestones for this. Oh my goodness. Um, <laughs> Nikki, thank you for being a member for five months. Congrats on 10K Peyton. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. 
Um, we're almost at the bottom. I read Caroline's. Thank you again for the 1999. Dimples, uh, thank you for being a member for one month. Congratulations. Thank you so, so much. Jamie, thank you for being a member for eight months. Let's go. Thank you so much. Kathleen, thank you for being a member for nine months. Nine months. Let's go. Sky, thank you for being a member for four months. Congrats, Peyton. Let's go. Thank you so much, guys. I made it through. <laughs> I made it through and everybody else welcome in. I hope you're doing so very good in case you've never seen me before in your life This is a strange day to come in, but hi, um, welcome to the corner. My name is Peyton Hope you're doing so very good today. We're working on my brand new island, which is an entirely black and white island It is an old Hollywood mafia movie gone wrong and today I want to do some planning for it. I want to come up with the lore for the island with you guys. Maybe do another villager hunt if we're feeling chaotic. Um, and just like figure it out what we're going to do. Have a good time. Um, what else do I need to tell you? Also, Dimples! Dimples, thank you for gifting a membership. Oh my goodness. I was going to get, I was going to say something about memberships, but you beat me to it. Can we get some hearts and hype in the chat for Dimples and for Emily? Welcome back to the Sloth Squad. Let me get you to the screen. Let me update the thing. So a huge, huge, th this is like a just chatting stream in the beginning. I've got so much to say. Um, Thank you. Thank you so much to our channel members. I appreciate you so much. I hope you guys uh, had fun at the members control my live stream we did on Friday. I had so much fun. I hope you guys had fun. This room still vaguely smells of the jelly beans. And I want you to know the Band-Aid flavored jelly beans stayed with me all weekend. So I thought about you all <laughs> all weekend. Linda, thank you for being a member for nine months. Congrats, pay well-deserved. Thank you so much. And, well, and Rilana, hello. Thank you for being a member for two months. Congrats on 10K. You are such a bright light. Ah, stop. But you deserve all the loves. Sh shut up. No. <laughs> you guys. No, you. Stop. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, Yeah. Thank you so, so much for, for being a part of the members control my live stream. It was so, so much fun. Um, now, uh, so, so, uh, here's what happened after that stream though. So we got, we did the members control my live stream because we hit our Mar our February milestone of hitting 300 members. And so because of that, and because of how fun that was, um, we we made this we made this and we hit over 400 members and we were on our way to the 450 50 goal which is insane and thank you all so much um we did lose well over 100 members and so and so and so uh with the dimples is gifted we're back to 300 on the dot <laughs> so thank you so much um, and because it's the end of the month, and now I think that these goals are a little too much, um, I think the new goal will be if we can make it back to 400 members, then we'll do the um, 450 goal for 400 members instead. So if you're interested in joining the Sloth Squad, we would love to have you. Um, and yeah, thank you all so much for being here and for the continued love and support. It means the entire world to me. I don't think I have anything else to say other than thank you. And I'm just glad you guys are all here. I hope you're all doing so well. Oh, I do have something else to say. Haha. <laughs> um, at the beginning of my streams, I like to let my friends know I'm chronically ill and cute. I like to let my friends know I have a chronic pain condition. So I can be comfy and cozy. You could be in comfy and cozy. We can all be comfy and cozy together. That's how it works. Thank you all so much for being here. Okay, should we, um, oh, wait, okay, wait, wait, one more thing, one more thing. <laughs> the members already know some of this, but, but, you don't know all the tea. When I turn the game on, there's a little bit of a jump scare that's about to happen. So, we accidentally auto-filled not one, but two plots, and the members got to see who they were, except I went to just talk to one of those villagers, and, um, you're never going to believe whose island they came from. <laughs> so, uh, meet my new friend. <laughs> uh, this is my new friend, Tangy. She's not going to stay on the black and white island, but she's all the way from Corneria. So we are happy to have her. Um, <laughs> I have just gotten exclusively other Animal Crossing content creators, villagers, 
So thank you to Jade, thank you to Sienna, and thank you to Pat for your villagers. I appreciate it so much. <laughs> I appreciate it so much. Oh my God. I literally peed myself. This happened, like I noticed this a second before I started the stream. No, Lauren, I can't draw. I can't draw tangy. I can't draw tang. Can you believe though? Oh, and then you want, yeah. And then I got Rodney as well. And then Rodney is from Sienna. So not as good, not as good, but I got Rodney from Sienna. And then in case you're new, in case you're new and you're just joining us, welcome, welcome, welcome. Th this is not the theme. Hold on. Hold on. That's not the theme. Peyton, you didn't change the graphic before the stream, you amateur. Okay, it's this one. It's this one. It's this one. Um, so this is the theme for this island. I have two islands. The other one is my hard mode island. Don't worry, that one's not gone. Um, this is my all black and white old Hollywood crime story, the mafia movie, the rodent version. Yeah, and we already have some of these villagers. We went villager hunting and in one stream we got Raymond, Marlowe, Petrie, and then in another stream we also got Flurry. So it's looking good for us so far. So what I'm thinking about for this island, Jen! Jen, stop, take that back. Jen, take that back, that's too much. Jen, take it back, take it back, I need comfort. Jen, take that back. That's too much money. That's too much. You do too much. Jen. Jen. Thank you for the 1999. Uh, the 19. Thank you for the 999999 million. Uh, congrats on 10K. So proud of you and this welcoming community you've built. So much love and side eyes. Jen. Can we get some hearts and eyes in the chat for Jen? Jen, you didn't have to do that, you crazy person. Thank you so, so much. All the love, all the love. Jesus, what are you doing? Stop. <laughs> Stop this. Thank you so much. I, I appreciate it so much, though. And Dimples, thank you for the five. Currently playing Wildflowers. I'm loving it. Such a fun game. Also getting a Steam Deck soon. Let's go. I hope you enjoy your Steam Deck. Thank you for the five. I appreciate it so much. Please keep the hearts and hype going. I'm, I sh I'm sweating. I shouldn't have worn a long sleeve. I shouldn't have worn a long sleeve. What do you mean? What do you mean? Um... I need to spread love. It's been a rough couple days. So this is the stream and, and community I need to heal. Oh, I'm sending you all the love, Jen. I'm sending you all the love. Thank you for being here. I'm giving you a hug. Here, I'll just come, come to New York and I'm just gonna give you a hug, okay? I'm just gonna give you a hug. Dimples, you didn't need to do another donation to correct yourself. <laughs> Thank you for the two. Steam Deck, rather. I knew what you meant. I knew what you meant. And Michelle, thank you for the 199. I appreciate it so, so much. Thank you, guys. You guys are all very kind. I thank you, thank you, thank you for the support. It means the entire, entire world. And um, I didn't, I never thought we would get this far. So thank you, thank you, thank you for being here along the way and being my friends, supporting the content, and indulging in my chaos. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for indulging in my chaos. Um, so yeah, here's what I want to do. I want to plan out the lore of the island. I want this to be a kind of sister island to my murder mystery island in that it is the story of an, a mafia movie, a crime movie. Did you miss Alex? No, this is not the 10K celebration stream. <laughs> Uh, this is not the 10k celebration stream because this was all unexpected this week So um, when I have more than just a few hours to stream, I'd like to do a long dedicated Celebration stream and hopefully I can get him to do it Then but when I told him he was like, I'll talk when I'm ready and I was like, okay He was like, I'll talk when I'm ready and I was like, okay, but but they want to hear you talk Okay, fine, sir. Um, so yeah, I want to come up with the lore. <laughs> How many times am I gonna say the same thing? I want to come up with the lore for the island. I want to figure out. Um, Yuri, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for being a sloth. I appreciate it so much. Um, it's um, it's a like a crime 
movie they're filming, but there's also a real life crime. So we need to figure out who is the murderer. We need to figure out like who is the star of the movie. We need to figure all of that out. I also want to like figure out what the map is going to look like. Um, what's the other thing? I have it all in a Canva doc. Oh, and then like write down some items we need, start thinking about codes, all of that stuff. But honestly, my brain is absolutely um, mush. So I wanna try kicking out another one of the villagers for the first little bit, try and go for a little bit of a hunt, take a break, do some planning, maybe hunt some more, if that's okay. <laughs> if that's okay, if that's okay, my brain's a little mush right now. So <laughs> I kinda wanna just, you know, vibe for a little bit just vibe for a little bit hope that's okay emma welcome in i hope you're doing so good what's up what's up yeah i think that i i think the voice reveal will be recorded just because i think it gives me too much anxiety of like if he like stands here off camera and i like point it to him like you'll be able to see his reflection in the stuff back there i think <laughs> so i probably will be a, it'll probably be a pre-recorded voice memo but <laughs> We'll figure that out. But yeah, I'm planning on doing a whole um, 10K celebration. It was just um, not expected for this all to happen this week. Uh, I thought we still had quite a bit of time. So. Yep. Yep. Is there a mouse mafia and an enemy hamster mafia? No, it's just a big rodent mafia. He could always do a voiceover over video. Yeah. I don't think I would do a video though, cause I feel like, I feel like we're at this strange point now um, with my content where I feel like the Dream audience and the video audience doesn't always overlap. So if I were to just put it in like a video, I think people would not know what's going on. Our stream friends would know what's going on. But I think that <laughs> I I I can't believe it. I do think now we have gotten to the point where people watch my videos but don't know I even stream. Which is not something I ever expected. So I wanna keep that as a stream thing. Charles, hello, welcome in. I hope you're doing so good. Also, also, wait. Also, 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 if you missed this stream on Friday, if you missed this stream on Friday, I know, I and listen, I get it. You were like, oh, Peyton's playing a new game. She's doing like a weird combat game. Shh, shh. This is my favorite game of the year so far. <laughs> I have been playing this game so much. Um, and you guys, guys, you need to, you gotta get down with Cereza, okay? It's, it's good, it's fun. Welcome to the combat corner. <laughs> Welcome to the combat corner. I had way more fun than expected. And I've been playing a little bit off stream and it's been so much fun. Who is she? I don't even know. I don't even know. The member stream was so much fun. I spent almost nine hours playing Cult of the Lamb. Oh my goodness. And my boyfriend also got Pokemon Violet for me. Oh my God, that's crazy. That's crazy. Hi Nat, welcome in. No, I haven't gone to the um, post office yet. I only have a notification for um, one package there currently. So I'm planning on like giving it a little bit and then going next week just cause I can't go there that frequently. So I try to only go like once a month and just grab all the stuff that's there. Um, so yeah, I can't do it this week, but hopefully maybe next week. Hopefully maybe next week. Thank you so much for sending something. I appreciate it so much. I appreciate it so much. Um, and thank you guys for 78 likes on the stream. I appreciate it so much. Thank you all for being here. Thank you for liking the stream. I'm not even gonna tell you to subscribe anymore. I I changed the nightbot command. The night the nightbot command doesn't say. <laughs> the nightbot command does not say help us get to 11k. It just more numbers don't exist 
ever again. So I'm never going to ask you to subscribe again. Well, maybe, but just not yet. <laughs> maybe, but not yet. I just checked when my membership ends. It actually expires when I have ear surgery on April 20th. That is the day before my birthday. I hope. Let's go for a million. Stop. No, no. But you know what is kind of a, a cool little, um, like a stupid little, because, uh, okay, because like people keep, <laughs> people are asking me, they're like, oh, so what do you get? Like now that you hit 10K, like are you going to get that plaque? And I'm like, no. They're like, oh, do you get verified? No. So what do you get? The pride and the honor. But also, I am no longer considered a nano influencer. This corner is now a micro influencer. So we are all micro popular, everybody, guys. We're all micro sloths. <laughs> we are micro sloths now, everybody. And that is, that's a flex, I think. <laughs> Kayla, welcome in, hope you're doing good. We're little baby sloths, we're micro sloths. <laughs> Uh, I love it. <laughs> my, I'm in my iPod Nano era. We love a Nano. We, I didn't know what those terms were until recently, and I saw like, okay, there's like, if you have um, between 1,000 and 10,000 subs, you're a Nano influencer. If you have 10,000 to 100,000, you're a micro. <laughs> we did it. We're little babies. We're little babies. <laughs> All right, no one wants to move. Uh, you are, Michelle, you are the top super chatter. You you have been the top super chatter. You dethroned Koi um, and your support is too much. Your support is too much, Michelle. It's too much. We appreciate it so much. Remember to hit the top eight and you gotta go for the one million. I think that would give me um, far too much anxiety. To be honest, I think that would give me a level of anxiety I couldn't even handle. <laughs> I don't even know if I can handle the um, the 10K <laughs> yet. <laughs> I don't think I can handle, I don't think I can handle like, um, I don't have like, uh, I don't have like crazy dreams of being like a, you know, a million subscriber channel and like starting my own like team sloth, like, Welcome to the Team Sloth house. Like, it's not, it's not that. It's not that. Imagine, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> Imagine, welcome to the Team Sloth house, everyone. Like, welcome, welcome to my collective. No. <laughs> um, I think I put that much in my first stream. It's accumulated. It's accumulated, Michelle. My own line of energy drinks. Maybe I do my own coffee brand. I do my own coffee brand. Maybe that. Also, even though, speaking of um, products, even though we've changed our milestones, we are still doing the member exclusive merch. I started working on it, so stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for that, and also I started working on the next month's merch collection too. So stay, stay tuned for that. And then yeah, like I was saying before, um, we're making it the new goal for the paint and sip is just back to 400 members. Ignore the 50. Ignore the 50. 50 doesn't exist. The 50 doesn't exist. Uh, oh my God, Greta, that's so much math. Greta, that's scary. Greta, that math is scary. I'm scared. I'm scared. What is Peyton's version of top of the morning? I don't know. Like top of the, like, like the saying top of the morning, like hello. Apparently I say, what's up, what's up, what's up. <laughs> Apparently I'm like, what's up, what's up? When people come in, <laughs> which I didn't know I did until Artsy said it. Now I'm now I'm so aware of it every time I say what's up to people. Kaylee! Kaylee! That was not an invitation, Kaylee. Kaylee, that was not an invitation. Can we get some hearts and hype in the chat for Kaylee? And for Marshall and Michelle and Charles, and Eleanor, and Olivia, and Luann Marie, and Elizabeth, and Zoe, and Amanda Tori, and did 
I miss one? I think I did, because I counted nine, but there's ten. Wait, who did I miss? Who did I miss? Who did I miss? And Nat! Did I say Nat? Did I say Nat? Nat. Wait, hold on. Sorry. Nat, Marcel, Michelle, Charles, Eleanor, Olivia, Luann, Elizabeth, Zoe, and a mandatory. Let's go! <laughs> Welcome to the Sloth Squad, everyone! Let's go! Can we get some hearts and hype in the chat for Kaylee? And for our new friends, I can do this math. This math is easy. Now we're at 310 members. 310, we're inching our way back to 400. Thank you so, so much. I appreciate it so much. Um, also, we're getting to the end of the month too. So next month, we'll also have a brand new set of um, milestone perks again. And if you ever have any crazy ideas of things you want to see for that, let me know because I'm open for ideas. <laughs> I am open for ideas. This is the second gifted membership I've had. Let's go, Olivia. Congrats. I'm so glad you guys are all here. Thank you for being in the squad. See, I did that math. That math was easy. That math was at 10. And I could handle that. I can handle that. I can handle it. Hey, what's your morning routine? Oh, God. I wake up in chronic pain. <laughs> I wake up in chronic pain every day and I'm sad about it for a few minutes. And then I scroll on TikTok a little bit and then I get over it and then I get up. <laughs> and then I hang out with my dog and then I walk my dog. It depends on the day, actually. I don't really do that much in a day. <laughs> Is it Jod of Toast? Hello. Ayo. First stream ever. And so sorry I can't stay, but I wanted to say hello. Hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, did my joy... How do these joy... Okay. The Joy-Con is defective. Because th these have been plugged in. These have been plugged in. Let's switch. Listen. I'm, I know that I am a professional... <laughs> am I supposed to be professional now? I'm not. Um, welcome in. I hope you're doing so good. Yeah, the Joy-Cons are the worst. I, I hate a Joy-Con. I love a Joy-Con, but I hate it. I also hate it. These ones have been plugged in. These specific ones only work when they're, um, when I'm playing handhelds. Uh, when I hear these words, my STEM major brain is activated. Which ones? About, about math? Did I make an upcoming emo math related? Maybe. Did I make a math related emo? C couldn't be me. Who never did that? Andulina, thank you so much for the 199. Thank you for the sticker. I appreciate it so much. Can we get some hearts and hype in the chat? I appreciate it. Thank you so much for being here. Oh, nano and micro. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Guys, we we've done it. Do you remember that one stream someone told me that I'm I'll never be popular? I'm micro popular now, so I feel pretty good about myself. <laughs> so I feel pretty good now. My favorite emo. Oh, I'm so glad. I made the font slightly bigger for that one. There's it's still small because it, you know, this is an emo, but I love that one too. I think out of the new ones, the hot one is still my favorite. But I made two new Never before seen emotes for um, if we ever unlock more. They're cute. Rodney, do you want to leave? Hey, what if you left? And if no one asks to move out for like a while, then we'll just move on. <laughs> we'll just move on. I just, my brain, I was like, I think we need to just like, we need to start with some, oh, also happy, um, <laughs> happy uh, um, Animal Crossing day. Happy three year. Oh, God, Peyton. Happy um, Animal Crossing Day. Happy three years to Animal Crossing. I didn't even say that. What a jerk. What a jerk. Hey, I've never catch you live because I'm from Germany. Hi, welcome in. Is it Memda? Hi, it's nice to meet you. It's nice to see you. Welcome to the corner. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it so much. Oh, everyone show me your favorite emo in the chat. The, listen, the little ghost is still one of my favorites, too. It's one of my faves, too. I made two new ones that pretty cute. And for next month's merch collection, there is one design I spent a solid 
10 hours on. There is one design I spent a solid 10 hours on. And I am proud of it. And I'm proud of it. Should I have spent that long on it? No. Did I? Yes. Absolutely I did. Absolutely I did. Me and my computer screaming all day. No, it's fine. Your birthday is on Friday. Happy almost birthday. I had twin great grand babies be born yesterday. Oh my God, congratulations. It's Daphne. Hi, it's nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being a sloth. I appreciate you so much. Thank you so much. Also, you know what else I fixed? I fixed this thing. The, the, the images that move, I fixed it. Ha. Huh? I did it. Pistachio Queen, how are you? Oh my God, it's been eight years. How are you? Pistachio Queen. You still make me want pistachio ice cream every time you come in. How are you? Will you ever play Stardew Valley? Uh, stream again slash video about it. I spent the last two days watching the three streams you have of it. Oh my God, really? <gasps> They're so long ago. I actually have been planning on making content about it because I literally like a week ago. Um, no, it's been like two weeks now. I started over on Stardew off stream by myself and I want to give it a successful playthrough by myself off stream to figure it out. And then what my plan is, is to reflect on that. But also I want to try and get it on my PC and do mods. Stardew mods. I want to be a little cottagecore princess. <laughs> so yeah, very much, very much in the plans because I've been playing it quite a bit off stream. Um, I was thinking about getting back into it. It's good. It holds up. It's fun. It holds up and it's fun. I'm doing great, Pistachio Queen. I hope you're doing good. I don't know how long I've been on this channel for. I'm just glad you're here. Doesn't matter if you've been here for a day, a week, a month, a lifetime. Thank you all so much for 100 likes, by the way. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to try out that one game you showed in a new cozy game video where it's like Stardew on Mars. Oh yeah, Mars base, Mars base. I didn't actually get around to trying it, but I was also very excited about it. There are so many, like, there are so many. You're gonna get annoyed with me about like how many, like <laughs> I was supposed to film a video today, I didn't. So if all my videos come out back to back later in the week, it is what it is. But there are so many games, literally all the games dropped this week or are dropping this week. There are so many that I'm excited about and I'm like, can't we space them out a little bit? Like, do they all need to come out this week? Like, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> like, I gotta buy, like, I'm buying them all this week. <laughs> um, too many games, not enough time, literally. Rodney, don't you wanna leave, baby? Don't you wanna leave? What have you left? Peyton, tell them how we basically didn't have a winter though. We didn't have a winter. Oh, I look cold? Oh, I'm not. I'm I I'm glad I don't look sweaty. That's good. Good. No, yeah, we didn't have a winter. What's what's the cold? My body thinks we had a winter. You know? I know. St <laughs> Kathleen, I know. So Steam decides, let me ha Okay, I so I made Oh, my joy cons are drifting. So, okay, I made this this video last week and it is now my most viewed video on the channel. So thank you if you watched it. I made a video that was like sales going on on Switch and Steam. And it was half like, yeah, approximately half Switch, half Steam. Literally, I post that video two days later. Steam is like, Here's our big, even bigger, massive um, Steam Spring sale. And I'm like, I cannot make another sale video. Everyone's gonna hate me. <laughs> I'm like, everyone's gonna hate me, but I was so mad. I was like, yeah. Because there were so many more games I, I would have talked about. Coral Island is on sale. I'm like, uh, guys, we couldn't have waited a few days. I guess I was just, maybe I predicted it. <laughs> But the sale, saving the money. I know, I know, I know. I just bought so many things from the other sale, though. I just spent $60 on Bayonetta. <laughs> I spent $60 on Bayonetta. Worth it, though, honestly. Worth it. Actually, technically, I spent $100. Technically, I spent $100 because I bought a voucher. 
Sabrina, hello! I bought Coral Island, can't wait to play it in my Steam Deck. They give it a yellow on Steam Deck. I think it runs good. I think it runs good. Sometimes it takes a little bit to load. My Bayonetta stream that I did last Friday, I had the time of my life. I'm not gonna lie to you. And I've been playing it off stream. Uh, see, it's right there. See, you can, you can, you can see. You can, you can see it exists. <laughs> and, 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 uh, look at this. Um, look at Cheshire. Look at Cheshire. He's green now. Uh, in my game, he's green now. He's green. Oh, I, you mean the prequel? I thought you meant the mainline, but no. No, 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 no. The cozy one. The cozy one. <laughs> the cozy one I play. Um, Wyla, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. What's up, what's up? Hope you're doing so good. I hope you're doing so good. Um, key to my heart. Hi, Peyton. Congrats on 10K. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, Mordow is on sale, but I don't think you'd go for a medieval fighting game. Who knows? Maybe I'm, maybe I'm the combat queen. Maybe I'm the combat queen. Maybe. Everything is all upside down. <laughs> I vote for more Cult of the Lamb on the channel. I agree. We had a lot of fun. We had a lot of fun on the member stream playing it. It was a good time. Combat corner. Combat corner. It's welcome in. This is our new, we've, we've entered a new era. And uh, Pepe likes to be cozy, but fight. Apparently. I want to be cozy, but I also want to fight. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. Am I? Am I? How much am I kidding? How much am I kidding? No. I'm, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um. What else was I going to tell you? Um. I was gonna, t I had something to tell you and I don't remember what it was. I'm excited about life, that's it. I'm just excited. I don't have, I don't remember what I was gonna tell you. Oh yes, I got my stuff for the cosplay stream, which is also gonna be next week. I got my stuff for the cosplay stream. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen next week. It's gonna happen next week. We're gonna look cute. Happy Monday, Sloth Micro Corner. <laughs> Not Sloth Micro Corner. Have a good night. Thank you so much. <laughs> um, it was funny because when I told uh, when I told Alex that, I was like, you know, I'm a micro influencer. He was like, oh, when do you um not be a micro influencer? And I was like, I don't know, probably like fifty thousand. And then I looked it up, and it's a hundred thousand. So um. We're micro influencers for life. <laughs> and I'm honored to be in the club. I'm honored. I'm honored to be in the club. He was like, oh, that's steep. I didn't mean to sit on that toilet, by the way. I didn't mean to sit in the toilet. Rodney, what if you, Marlo, not you. Okay, one day forward, one day forward. Not you, Marlo, you're not, you're not allowed to leave. Why hasn't Sterling asked to leave? Like Sterling has to know I hate him, right? Sterling has to know that I hate him. You got gifted, yes you did. Kaylee gifted 10 memberships and you were a part of that. So welcome to the Sloth Squad. Welcome to the Sloth Squad. We're excited to have you and we appreciate you so much. Crossing my fingers that Rodney or Sterling leaves. It could be Rodney, Sterling, Diva, Norma, Tangy. It won't be Tangy though, because she just asked to move in. And then there's another, there's another. Who else from, oh, Gonzo. Gonzo is still here? Is Gonzo still here? I think. Wesley, hello, free off work and I start a new less suck job in two weeks. I hope the less suck job is indeed less suck job. And I hope that it's good. Welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. Nanners, hello. Congrats on 10K, how exciting. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I cannot believe. I still cannot believe. I don't know why. I could never make a, like a singular friend in real life. So 
I could never make a singular friend in real life. So the fact that I convinced 10,000 people to click a button is pretty crazy. That's a little cuckoo. That's a little cuckoo. Sterling is still appreciative of not being labeled the murderer. He was almost the murderer, but then it was it was too easy. It was too easy. I had to keep everyone guessing, you know? Had to keep everyone guessing. Same. <laughs> yeah. Making friends in real life is hard. But there's something nice about, like, the, you know, making your little weird friends on... We're all just little weirdos. Playing Animal Crossing on the internet. You know, that's it. That easy. Making friends here, easy. Every time I see someone like referencing Animal Crossing in real life, I almost pee my pants. I remember um, I was walking my. Okay, ignore that fish. Um, I was walking my dog like a couple months into my like streaming and stuff. And I saw someone when I was at the park with Dexter and they were wearing a Dodo Airlines shirt. And I, I ran away from them. My, like, why? I could have been like, oh my God, you like Animal Crossing, me too. I ran away from them. I didn't know how to react. I ran away. <laughs> I was so stunned. I was like, oh, they know what that thing that I like is. Willie, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. It is Gonzo that's still here. Hi, Gonzo. I didn't know. I was like, what that? Camille! 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 Thank you for the 49. Oh my God. Thank you for the 49.99. Can we get some hearts and hype in the chat for Camille? Thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. Thank you, Camille. Camille also sent me some lovely things from my throne wish list, and one of them were the, they're actually sitting next to me. One of them are these super cute earrings, and I just got these because they were like handmade. Too nice. You're too, and I wear the glitter all the time. Camille, oh, and this too, I think. Camille, Camille does too much. The sloth necklace I wear literally every day. <laughs> Camille, thank you so, so much. I appreciate it. Yes, keep the hearts and hype coming. Guys, you're doing too much. You know what you're doing too much? I think you're doing too many things. Too many of the things is what you're doing. Oh, I, how did I mess up my screen? Okay, no, we're good, we're good. <laughs> thank you so much, Camille. I appreciate it. And I read the message, right? Did I, I didn't just scream, congrats on 10K fan. I was like, did I, I was screaming. I was like, but I did I actually read the message. Thank you so much, Camille. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> McPean, you need to make sure you read the message. Don't just like scream about it. Like you, the whole point, the whole point is to read the message. <laughs> I'm really good at reading. I'm really good at reading and I'm really good at math. Should this be a break Peyton stream? It doesn't need to be. It doesn't like, it doesn't need to be. You're already doing too much. Michelle, thank you for being a member for two months. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the love and support. I appreciate it just so much. You guys are crazy. Um, Literally, 11 new members. I don't want to even tell you how many super chats. Too many, too many, too many. Thank you, guys. <sighs> Jesus. You do too many things. I, might, I can't lift my arms because I'm sweating. I literally cannot lift up my arms because I probably am pit stain central. Um, literally, no one wants to move off of this island, though. Like, no one wants to move. Raymond, you don't. Oh, you have to stay. But like, Diva, you don't. You don't want to move. All right, I'm gonna give it like another two tries, and then if not, we'll just move on and let's just start planning the island, and then we'll come back to this. <laughs> then we'll come back to this. We have plenty of things we need to get done tonight, so. Let's do something else. <laughs> if this, let's give it like a few, couple more minutes, a couple more minutes, a few more, a few more, a few more, a few more. Um, Emily, welcome back. I hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing so good. Thank you for being here. Thank you all for being here. I appreciate you. Appreciate you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Marla, hello, welcome in. Um, why did I reach 10K subs? I don't know. 
I stink. <laughs> Why did I reach 10K subs? Let's ponder the reason. Um, I don't know. Maybe people felt bad for me. <laughs> Maybe people felt bad for me. I don't know. Maybe like, oh, that little loser girl. Let's subscribe to her channel. <laughs> because she's micro famous. Because <laughs> she's a micro influencer. <laughs> I can't. I can't take that seriously. I can't take that seriously. Peyton, so what do you do? Yeah, I'm a... I'm actually... I'm actually a micro-influencer. <laughs> I'm proud and honored. I just love... I love the title. Because what makes you pop... That's what... Yeah. Hi, Brooke. Hope you're doing good. <laughs> Because you're sweet and your streams, uh, oh, bring joy to my days. Thank you so much. I thought you weren't popular till a million subs. I'm, I, you're right. You're right. And I'm never going to be popular, but that's okay. I don't have any desire to be. This is good. This is good. Micro popular. Yeah. We're micro popular. That's the way I like it. Can stay like that. This isn't going to be one of those times where I'm like, we're inching our way to blah. Nope. We did it. We in we inched our way all the way there. <laughs> we inched our way to the moon. We don't need to inch our way to anything else. For now. No. We don't need... To, well, actually, technically, we are inching our way to 10,100 subscribers. But, like... We've done it. We've done it. We've, we inched our way. And now... We don't need to, we don't need to do any more inching. Now we can just like not inch anymore. We can just like not worry about it. Not that I was worrying about it before. We, our goals are met. We can, our dreams have come true. We can just like, this is what dreams are made of. What if we want to inch? I don't think I do it. <laughs> I don't think I do. I think, I think I'm, I think I'm satisfied. I think that like my hopes and dreams have already been made. And now my brain doesn't see anything past this. <laughs> hey now, hey now. This is what dreams are made of. Hey now, hey now. This is what dreams are made of. We're not done until the Alex face reveal. He said that for 100K, but I'd have to check with him about that. Because he said that when I first started my channel. And while he is very supportive and he's like, I've always believed in you. I don't know if he quite anticipated my channel ever getting, you know, this many people to watch it. So I'd have to verify that he was okay with that before I promised that further. Um, but definitely we'll do the voice reveal. Sterling doesn't want to move. Ugh. So 100k is the next goal. No, the, the next goal is that... Um, we don't count numbers anymore. We we hit the we hit the unthinkable. We hit the unthinkable. We we hit the unthinkable. And now that we've hit the unthinkable, there is no greater number than 10k. <laughs> there isn't a number greater than 10k. Like we hit the biggest number possible. And it's that. Is that if and Tony, hi, welcome in. Hope you're doing so good. Thank you all for saying. Congrats on 10K. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, I fell into the Dinkum fandom. I have not played it yet, but I've been seeing lots of people play it. I hope you're having a good time. Hope you're having fun. I feel like we're in all of the updates, all the new games and all the updates. Who, who said this? Who said, ah, uh, who said this? I think it was Sarah B. I think it was, if Sarah, Sarah B, if you're here, tell me if it was you, I think. On my, on my, um, one of my streams, I predicted the Coral Island update and I was like, ugh, watch the Coral Island update come out like tomorrow and I'm not ready. And then it came out tomorrow and they commented and they were like, can you do, can you start saying that about Animal Crossing? Maybe you'll be right. Guys, watch the Animal Crossing update come out like tomorrow. <laughs> I'm kidding. Watch a new Animal Crossing drop, like game drop tomorrow. Myra, thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for being a sloth. And Brittany, hello, welcome in. And Ruby, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing so good. What's up, what's up? What if I just start saying that with Animal Crossing? Guys, ugh. I don't want the next Animal Crossing game to come out within the month. No, I'm kidding. Within the year. 
within the 2024 because I'm just not prepared for it. <laughs> Congrats on 10K. Thank you so much, Verbi. I appreciate it so much. And hi, Denise. Welcome in. I hope you're doing so good. Maybe I have the power to predict. Maybe I do. Maybe I manifest it. Who knows? Who knows? All right, I'm giving this one last go, and then we're going to not do this anymore. <laughs> oh, wait. Do that. Do that, and then... Cool. Then we'll actually be productive. <laughs> Then we'll be productive, shall we? I think we could be productive. I think. I think, I think, I think. Today's the third anniversary of ACNH. Some kind of acknowledgement by Nintendo would be nice. I know. We're more hyped than everyone else. Like, I was watching Kato's stream last night of, like, um, her going through and watching all of the old trailers. It was so nice. It was so nostalgic. And I know Korra is streaming tonight and was going to play... Um, I think playing old Animal Crossing games. Um, so why are the creator, I mean, not me. And then I'm over here just like trying to kick out villagers. I'm fake influence. She, she's not good enough to be a micro influencer. Oh my God. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. It's like such a big thing. It's such, I, it's funny for me because when I was watching Kato's stream last night, I actually didn't play Animal Crossing New Horizons right at the drop. Um, this is my first Animal Crossing game, and I had heard of Animal Crossing growing up, but I didn't really know what it was about. I'd never played it. I got Animal Crossing New Horizons like a, a month or so in um, when they released Leaf because I saw videos of Leaf on TikTok and I said, mm -mm, yep, mm, I want that game. And then I got it. So I never got to see all of the old Nintendo Directs before the game came out. But I did watch, I remember watching the 2.0 update. It was before I started streaming and I was watching Pat's stream when it happened. And then I watched it and I was losing my mind. And then I started streaming a couple months after that. Which is crazy. The fact that I grew up with Animal Crossing. I wish I played it growing up, but Everything, you know what? May, I don't know. It's meant to find it now. I really like decorating, though. So whenever people ask me to go play the old games, I'm not sure if I would like them as much. You don't want to leave, Rodney. <laughs> I'm not sure if I would like them as much because I really have enjoyed the, um, the decor and all of the things that make New Horizons what it is, you know? Gabriel, hello. Welcome in. What's up? How have you been? It's a Peyton. It is. How are you? I hope you're doing good. I only played the GameCube one before Animal Crossing New Horizons. I I had friends who played the Wii one. Like I had a friend who always had the Wii one. Play <gasps> Gonzo, let's go. Let's go. Just when I was about to give up. Oh, look at the drift. Oh my God, look at the drift. Okay, hello. Hello. Peyton. Can I bend your ear? Absolutely, you can. Goodbye. I love you so much. I love you so much. I love you so much, Gonzo. I love you so much. But goodbye. Cool. Cool. Go. Have you ordered a pro controller? No, I haven't picked out one that I like. <laughs> I haven't picked out one that I like because I'm annoying. Because I'm annoying. I'm annoying and I haven't picked out one that I like. Um. Okay. Let's villager hunt. Should we villager hunt for a little bit? Are you guys over villager hunting? I'm not. I'm not. So yeah, the plan is let's villager hunt for a little bit. Then we will um, do some of the things I have planned, which is um, come up with the lore of the characters on the island. And I already know what the map shape is going to look like, but I don't know whose house is going to be where. So I want to figure that out. I have like a Canva thing all set up for that as well as um, just start like brainstorming some items that are black, white, and gray that I could get a lot of. I think it's gonna be like a city motif. It's gonna be like a city core motif, all grayscale, black and white in the snow. So there's no green whatsoever. And it's going to be um, old Hollywood, cool stuff, I hope. She says, hopefully. She says, hopefully. 
I love how you're making a black and white one. I'm doing a rainbow island. Let's go. We love the color palettes. What's my map shape? It's gonna be a film clapper. It's a... Uh, there, I have a film clapper on the, yeah. It's gonna be this, love the film clapper with a rat on top. It's not gonna be open entirely like this. It's gonna be like, I think like this. Rat on top, maybe a block of cheese as well. Um, <laughs> I, was, I said that so seriously. Like I've said, I th feel like I've said that as if that's the most serious thing I've ever told you in my life. Yes, that's, that's, that's what the plan is gonna be. But we might have room for other shapes. So we might have room for like, I don't know, something else, something else. I don't know, <laughs> I, you know, yeah. All black and white flowers. Those are gonna be the only flowers. Um, No trees, no trees, zero trees. I don't wanna see a tree. The only tree that we'll have is the decayed tree in the darkest variant. It's dark brown, but it look it's close enough. It's the closest we could get, I think. Or wait, no, the trees will be, yeah, well, we can do trees because it'll be set in the snow, so they'll have the white on the top. We'll see though, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. Katie, hello, welcome in. I hope you're doing good. What's up, what's up? Thank you for being here. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. Yeah, I don't know all the details yet. We'll have to see like how strict we are about the color because, um. There are lots of items. Oh, there are white decayed trees. Are there really? Amber, I didn't know that. That's why we need to make the item list. I literally don't even know. Cause I feel like there are so many items that are like black and white, but also this color. And I want it to try, I want to try to make it as like black, white, and gray as possible. Oh, we have a villager at the camps. Not us getting a campsite visitor. Do we have a campsite visitor today? We have a campsite visitor. We have a campsite visitor every stream now, and that's how it is. Okay. Um. So we have a campsite visitor. Let us use this camp. It's the today is the first day of spring, by the way. Happy spring. Let's say this campsite visitor tells us how the entire season is gonna go. That's a lot riding on one villager. This villager will tell us how the entire season is gonna go. So let's do what we always do. I'm gonna go into this campsite. I'm not gonna look at who it is, but I want you to tell me if they're good, if they're bad, and then give me a hint, okay? Are they good, are they bad, and a hint. And then my dreamies are on the screen. So if for some reason, if for some reason, it's one of those people, then we get really excited, all right? All right, let's go. I'm not looking, I'm not looking. I'm not gonna look. Last time you all thought my like villagers that I thought were super cute were ugly. So I don't know if I trust your opinion either. Can I trust your opinion? What do you think? What do you think? Are they good or are they bad? And can I trust you? Ew, purple er, cute, cute. Oh gosh, you guys are so mixed. She's cute, but not a dreamy. Not for this island. Ooh, some of you are saying, ew. Super cute, cute, but no. Okay, so someone purple? Who's purple that's like, questionable? She is kind of cute? A fave? She was on Pat's Halloween Island. Oh, it's Cleo. It's, what's wrong with Cleo? What's wrong with Cleo? Wait, wait, I'm sorry. What's ew about? I don't trust you. <laughs> I don't, I don't, tr I can't trust you. I know that she's not for this island, but don't say she's ew. She's a sweet little baby. I don't trust any of your opinions anymore. Are you guys gonna be like all the people who keep telling me that they're mad at me that I hate Klaus? Are you gonna tell me y'all like Klaus now too? Cause no, you don't. <laughs> No, you don't. I don't believe you. I and I don't believe you. She's a villager for sure. I would say she's one of the best horses. Wait. Where? Gonzo's packing. Okay. I was like, what? Right? Which one? That's Gonzo's house. Okay. We have to go one more day. I was so confused. I was like, why is there no plot? There's the, sh there's the short bit. Listen, listen. 
Am am I am I telling the game to keep making me have campsite visitors? No. 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 Does it continue to happen so I continue to make YouTube shorts of it? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Listen. Listen. I like I like. Don't tell anyone. I like making YouTube shorts now. But don't tell. Shh. Cuz for a while I was like, "Ugh, guys, do I need to make shorts?" And then I was like, "Okay, Peyton, like why don't you like try it? Maybe you'll like it." And then I did and I do. <laughs> I did and I do. So, I I like I like making them. They're cute. They're cute little like fun little I like them. I like them. Plus, I like I like everyone's hot villager takes in the comments. People people just like people get really mad that I don't like villagers, but also people love to tell me they hate the villagers I like. The my most viewed chore is the one where um, Leopold was our campsite visitor, and. So many people hate Leopold, apparently. <laughs> apparently, a lot of people hate Leopold. I don't know why. I think he's really cute. I can't believe you found Raymond before Bella. I can't believe it either. And Raymond was the second one. So we found Raymond before Petrie and Flurry. I can't believe it. I feel like next we'll see Dora or Humphrey. I feel like those are the next. I think Tasha and Walker will be the hardest ones to find. But we'll see. Fiona, hello. Good morning. 7.12 a.m. in Malaysia right now. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I hope it's been a good morning. I hope you have a good breakfast if you're a person that likes to eat breakfast. Because I don't judge you if you don't. Because I normally can't because I'm chronically ill and it gives me tummy aches right when I wake up. Boom. Ah. <laughs> Boom. Villager drama is what I live on. I live on the drama. I live for the drama. I live for the drama. Okay, cool. Plot's empty. Let's go. Let's go. I think Animal Crossing New Horizons made it easier to get the new villagers. I somehow got Dom and Megan within a couple tickets. Oh, really? So that is that why I found Raymond so fast? I remember. Do you guys remember when 2.0 came out? And... You would see like, I feel like you'd see Sasha and Shino and all of them like right away. I feel like every time I villager hunted after 2.0, it was always like Shino, Tiang Shang, like all of those new people. But now I don't ever see them that much. Every once in a while, but I feel like for a little bit, I was only seeing them. I don't eat breakfast. I don't eat breakfast except on vacation. That's accurate. On vacation, I want to eat, I'll eat three meals a day and snacks. <laughs> That's accurate. Yeah, I haven't seen Shino in a while either. I also haven't. And like Azalea. I never see Azalea. Azalea. Sasha. All of them. Fret. Who are those people? Who are those people? What is your favorite animal of all time? Now, if you had to guess. If you had to if you had to guess. What would you, what would your what would your guess be? What would you, what would your what's your best guess? <laughs> Rats. <laughs> that, that that they're up there. <laughs> they're out there. Um what would you what would you guess? <laughs> rats. Yes. Um the rat is my channel mascot and I am surrounded by rats. <laughs> no, my favorite animal are sloths. That's why the sloth is my logo. Um, Normac, hello. Some reason, whenever I go to hotels and check out, they charge me for eating the cheese. Are, are there cheese at hotels, like, that I'm unaware of? What cheese are we eating from the hotel? What cheese are we eating from the hotel? Is there, like, a cheese board? And we're... What? She calls us her little rats. <laughs> It's funny because I'm so scared of rats in real life. I've had so many traumatic rat experiences living in New York. Yeah, you're all my rats. <laughs> uh, I only villager hunt for the first three plots uh, because I don't autofill and then I get the villagers from order bots. Yeah, I 
Honestly, if I wasn't streaming, I probably would only villager hunt for a little bit and I'd give up. But I like to do these for streams because they're kind of like my version of just chatting streams. They're kind of nice. You're right. I'm going to ditch the spring merch collection and it's all going to be rat stuff. Ribot. I love Ribot. Ribot is so... I think Ribot is my favorite robot. Um... What do you think? Who do you think's the best robot? Rats for the member merch? I could. We could do that. We could do that. <laughs> Ribot is such a little baby. How do you get to be so baby? How do you get to be a little ribbit ribot? Only if you promise to come out with a mouse nose and whiskers for us to wear. I'm on it. I'm on it. I don't know if the merch company has that as an option, but I'll figure it out. I'll hand make them hand make the rat noses for everybody <laughs> welcome to my uh my new business which is just making rat noses sprocket i think sprocket is my least fave out of the three i think i like cephalobot more than sprocket but i like ribot more hi bots and cats hope you're doing good back in my 2021 back in 2021 my favorite villager was tasha i love tasha oh now my favorite is bella let's go we need a rat cheeseburger made by Peyton. Speaking of cheeseburger, I had the, I had the weirdest, it's not weird, but I went to this diner in like Times Square yesterday, which I, where I never am. And it was so busy. And I was, you know, when like the server comes over and they're like, oh, do you need a few minutes? I never want to tell them I need a few minutes. I literally never in my life want to tell them I need a few more minutes. So I panicked and I just ordered something like the first thing I saw I got this burger and it was it was a, a burger with bacon and cheese and like lettuce but also a piece of fried chicken on top of all of, all of that it was burger bacon cheese lettuce also a piece of fried chicken and like a spicy sauce and it was phenomenal <laughs> and it was phenomenal and your girl was very excited about it I was like there's no way that's gonna be good but it was and I had the leftovers today so Angus did you all know that Angus has cute little eyelashes did you know Angus had these cute little eyelashes because I didn't look at those cute little eyelashes what mascara? What mascara? What mascara are we using? I want to know. Hi, Gina. Can someone help me? I once found this YouTube video of an all-white island. Does anyone know the name of it? Ooh, I do not. I do not. I do not. Have you still got your drawings? I do, but I feel like that's just for the members. I feel like that the members, we had a, we had a moment there. I feel like we can't reveal that. Gotta go watch the members control my live stream VOD. All the secrets, all the secrets. We have to do another one of those. Those were so fun, but you guys need to be ruthless next time. You guys picked such like, you know, games that I normally play. You guys gotta be ruthless next time. You guys gotta be like, let's make Peyton suffer through XYZ game, you know? I also kept the Bean Boozle jelly beans but I don't want to ever eat them again. I don't think I want to eat them again. Um, I'll tell you right now, if miraculous, I'll change this. If miraculously we get to 500 members, <laughs> if we get to 500 members by the end of March, which is a lot of members away, I will eat the entire rest of the bag. If we get to 500 members by the end of March, I'll eat the rest of the bag. <laughs> uh, and it's pretty it's a pretty full bag because I only had like five of them. <laughs> Elden Ring stream, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Fortnite stream, when? Let's go. Peyton plays Minecraft. Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> So if I become a member and suggest Resident Evil, would you play it? If enough people voted for it, yeah. 
The way I did it this past time, and hi Holly, welcome in. The way I did it this past time was I did a Google form and people could just write in any game. And then whatever games I saw written in the most amount of times were the games I played. So I did six games in six hours and it was the six most written in games. And the only parameter was um, I only have a PC and a Switch. So the game just needed to be something that existed on PC or Switch, but I didn't have to have it. I was like, I'll, I'll spend a hundred bucks plus to buy games for this if I want to. To be honest, I saw the question and my mind blanked. No, it's okay. I had so much fun though. I had so much fun with everything we did play. It was a really great time. It was a good time. Rasher. I almost called him Boris. That's not Boris, it's Rasher. I like Rasher. I like Boris better, but Rasher's good. Rasher's good. Rasher's a good one. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, Animal Crossing was the most voted on game. It's like, guys, I always play Animal Crossing. What do you mean? What do you mean? Thank you all for 125 likes, by the way. I appreciate it so much. Thank you for liking today's stream. If you haven't liked today's stream, I heard a rumor that if you do, you can have a sip of my vanilla caramel iced coffee. And that is fun. That's fun. I bought and played through the entire game of unpacking from the member stream. Let's go. Oh my God, so you're farther than me. I haven't finished it yet. I hope you had fun. We had a good time though. I had to look at my switch to make sure I spelt it right. Wait, what? Spelt what right? What did we spell right? Welcome to Peyton's Corners, spelling bee. Welcome to my spelling bee. Let's all spell the villagers names. Do you remember? <laughs> Do you guys remember my, oh, the game you were suggesting? Got it, got it. I haven't played Figment yet, but it's on the Switch. It's here, it's here, I bought it. <laughs> I bought it, I just haven't, I haven't played it yet. Cause you wanna know why? Cause I've been playing this. Cause I've been playing this. And I've, I've, I've been playing this too, but I've, I've been playing this. I'm going to though. I heard the second one was great. I heard the second one was great. I didn't buy the second one yet because I'm like, well, the first one was on sale. So let me play that one first. Let me play that one first. But guys, I got the tea. I was sent like four new games that come out this week and I'm so excited. I haven't played any of them yet, but I'm so excited to play them. I'm so excited. Stardew Valley Farm Tour. It's I'm literally summer year one and everything is in shambles. I just got my coop. And I'm just starting to get people to like me. Annabelle, ugh. People got mad at me when I said I hate Annabelle too. People are like, what do you mean? She's such a little baby. And I'm like, I love that for you, but not for me, but not for me, <laughs> but not for me. I'll do a Stardew Valley farm tour when the farm looks good. Well, actually, Never mind. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Secret secrets. Yeah, people were like, Annabelle is my favorite villager. Why do you hate her? And I'm like, I just think that I like other ones better. When I got it the other day when it was on sale and haven't played it yet, but it looks so cute. What figment? I'm excited. I'm excited as well. Yeah, I I need to like this week is crazy. This week is crazy. I want to say like, yeah, I'm going to do it this week, but I have, I have all these other things that I need to make content about this week and I need to play the games before I make the content about them. And I have done none of the things. So, but I'm, it's, it's a good problem. There's too many games to play at once. I don't know why. I feel like every game ever is coming out this week and next. I feel like every March game is coming out this week and next. And I'm like, why? Once you start go start your PC, you'll never go back on console. Yeah. I want to play through my Switch version first, but then I fully intend to uh, be a modded Stardew queen. It's my goal. I want to have the aesthetic little things that everyone has. I want to, you know, I want to do it. 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 Want to do it. The koi fish is my favorite Animal Crossing. It's just a baby. It's just a baby. 
Andy. My favorite fish in Animal Crossing New Horizons is the sturgeon. <laughs> it's the sturgeon. Artsy, Pepe with the 10K. Who, me? Couldn't be me. I'm just a baby. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> Thank you, RNC. I appreciate it so much. How are you? I hope you're doing so good today. I hope you're doing great today. I hope you're having a nice day. Hope you're having a good day. <laughs> uh huh. Every time I open um my YouTube like studio app, I like double take still i'm not it's been a day it's been a day right it's it's not been like eight years it happened yesterday afternoon but every time i look at it i pee my pants a little bit yeah like i look at it and i just, it, pee my pants a little bit there's a 10 when there used to be single digit and that's weird that's weird i can't how do people like survive with like 100k how do they not like pee themselves like every five seconds <laughs> i'm over here like i'm overwhelmed um i'm like overwhelmed waking up and trying to get motivated to make videos oh my god i know i was supposed to film today too but i i went out into the world yesterday like i did a big excursion out into the world and it was extremely painful so i was i was very kind to myself and i was like peyton you don't need to make your video today. You are gonna stream and you can make a short and you are allowed to lay on the couch and watch Survivor today because you're in pain. Alex, thank you for the 199. Congrats on 10K, Peyton. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. And Hannah, welcome to the Sloth Squad. What the heck? Can we get some more tonight for the chat for Hannah? Thank you so much. And Artsy. Thank you for being a member for six months. Yes, self-kindness is top tier. Absolutely. And you should be kind to yourself too. The videos are gonna happen when they're gonna happen. The videos are gonna happen when they're gonna happen. And they're gonna be great and worrying about it. Don't do it. Did you have a good date? We did, it was fun. Um, Just painful. <laughs> Um, painful, but good, fun. We had a good time. We had a good time. Might do something again this weekend because I have the weekend off as well this weekend. Hello, my new friend. Is it, I want to say your name right. Is it Bingovia? Bingovia? Hi. Welcome in. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to see ya. Uh, I think you're really going to like Iona's Gamers Gab interview. I learned a lot from her and I really appreciate you suggesting her. I'm literally obsessed with her. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait to check it out. I'm literally like, I don't play favorites, right? Obviously. I do have people that I, I have a couple people I'm low key obsessed with and like are my role models. And like Iona is one of my role models. <laughs> Iona is one of my biggest uh, content role models. I just think she is just so fun, but also just like so wise. So fun, so wise, and just impeccable energy impeccable energy lyman i'm seeing all of the villagers we saw on the member stream have you guys noticed that hannah i'm so happy i found your channel through sabotage league i'm so glad too i'm so glad too thank you for being here i appreciate it i appreciate it so much i've loved being on it will i ever apply again i don't make you know what when i lost horribly uh, two weeks ago i was like no next season i'm not gonna be on it but now now it's been two weeks and i'm like over it now i'm like i'm not embarrassed if, by my loss anymore so maybe <laughs> maybe <laughs> um hi hi there welcome in hope you're doing so good all right wait you came here from iona stream from iona really love of my life I'm just a big fan. That's all. That's all. I'm just a big. I'm just a big fan. I have a couple people. I'm like, oh my god, I'm such a big fan. <laughs> like, I'm just such a big fan. Hi. <laughs> You're too competitive to sit it out. I feel like I shouldn't apply though. I should give other people a chance. <laughs> like, I feel like it's been enough of me. It's been enough of me. I'm taking up too much space. Yes, yeah, I was watching her stream yesterday. I love her. I love her too. Let's go and welcome in. I hope you're doing good. 
Zombie! Hi, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. What's up, what's up? Thank you for being here. Uh, Artsy, I was talking about you before. I was saying that I was unaware of the fact that when people come into my stream, I always say, what's up, what's up? Until I watched the VOD of you drawing Animal Crossing creators as villagers and the one that you drew me in. And you were like, Peyton always says, what's up, what's up? When people come in. And I was like, do I? And now every single time I say it, I'm like, what am I? I say this all the time. I didn't even know. Because there are things I say that I know are like a thing. Like, okay, I say chronically ill and cute. And I say, um... I appreciate you so much. I say that. I'm aware of that. But the what's up, what's up, I was not aware is one of my taglines. Who's that? Kurt. He's cute. He's cute. I didn't know that was one of my things. I didn't know it was one of my things. Unconscious of the what's up, what's up. You know what else I do? You know what else I do? And I literally do it every stream. Every stream I start, I go, both hands. I go, I go, both hands, every stream starts with. Why? I do, do I do that every stream? It's cute, it's cute, it's fine. But I do it every stream. Hi, Mothic, welcome in, I hope you're doing good. What's up, what's up? Oh, I clicked the wrong button. I clicked the wrong button. I clicked the wrong button. I'm predicting we're gonna dreamy. We had such good time. We had such good um, luck last time. I don't know if the luck could be as good this time, but we'll see. Hi, Celestine. I hope you're doing good. Hi, Pay and friends. Hello. Welcome in. I hope you're doing great. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? That's all I do is say the same things and do the same things. It's fine. Okay. Fine. Okay. It's all good. All good. All right, what time is it too? Because I don't want to do this the whole time. Okay, it's fine. We'll be fine. Tell me when you get bored of the villager hunting. Tell me when you get bored of it. I like doing. You know, I still like watching people villager hunt. I think there's something relaxing about it. Like seeing that hot pink monkey. Something nice about it. Like, oh wow. Look at that hot pink monkey that I don't want on my island. But I'm so glad I got to see you. I'm so glad I got to see you and leave, but sending all the love. Nana's fine. Remember when you caught the sturgeon? I think about that sturgeon every day. In fact, I have the sturgeon in a tank behind my chair. And I look at it every day and I just think, wow. That was really impressive that I caught that. I was like, it was really impressive. Really good. Vincent, hello. Welcome in. I hope you're doing so good. What is up? What is up? Hope you're doing good today. Hope you're doing great today. I hope you're having a nice day. I hope you're having a great day. Hope that all is well today and every day. Today and every day. Today and every day. You know? You know, you know? Guys, thank you for 136 likes, by the way. I appreciate you so much. Um, Almost to 140, so thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you guys for hanging out with me tonight. Does anyone have any fun plans for this? Oh, God. Our fun plan for this week, not seeing Al. Um, is anyone doing anything fun this week? What are we excited about? What's going on? What's going on? I already told you I'm excited for a couple new games coming out this week that I am planning to cover on the channel. And I am excited about the fact that I've been playing more games off stream. And I, I think that's nice. That's been nice for me. I've been trying to like use my downtime more productively. And instead of just like scrolling on TikTok, I've been trying to like play more games and trying to like do other stuff for the channel, you know? Um, I just noticed your Linus sweatshirt. My favorite Linus quote, having your blankie in the wash is like having your psychiatrist gone for the weekend. I don't know that quote, but I love it. Yes, I love the peanuts very much. <laughs> Have my household is heading to Kentucky for the archery nationals. Oh my goodness. I don't. Okay, so I like thought I could be Katniss <laughs> when I saw the Hunger Games and I was like, what if I, could I be like Katniss? 
And I had like a little um, plastic Nerf gun archery bow and I like would go around the house pretending I was Katniss. I was fully like in middle and high school. So it was like really embarrassing, but like I fully did it. Teresa, hi, Pay, congrats on 10K. So happy for you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And Kaylee, you're going to a pride parade this weekend. Let's go. I hope the weather is nice. Hope the weather is nice to be out. I'm assuming it's out. Is it outside? Is it indoors? Is it an indoor parade or is it nice outside? Neptune, congrats on 10K. Thank you so much. And Jade, hi, congrats on 10K. I'm so happy for you. What an accomplishment. Thank you so much. I, I appreciate it. I still, I can't believe it. It, it just happened yesterday. So it's, you know, we're still getting used to it, but <gasps> Agnes, my birthday twin. I love her. I love her. Love her. God. Classy Crossing. Hello. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Oh, I live in Florida. So it's pretty warm here. There you go. Okay. So the weather should be nice. Oh, that'll be so fun. Have a good time. Have a nice time. Cause I was over here like, oh, it's cold outside. I can't go to a parade. Uh, the congrats on getting 10K. Thank you so much, Fiona. I appreciate it so much. Thank you guys for being a part of it. It's because of you. It, It's because of you. It is be because of you. It's because of you. So thank you. You cracked me up. Oh my God, I'm so glad. I try my, I try to be, I try to be amusing. I try to be mildly entertaining you know i'm not over here like a stand-up comedian but i try to produce giggles i don't need to make you laugh but can i can i produce a giggle perhaps i try <laughs> i make myself giggle so at least at least there's that <laughs> at least there's that Bulba, are you going to take me to any good islands, though? Are we going to go to any good islands? I feel like, you know, maybe it'd be cool to see Walker. Like, wouldn't it be cool if I just walked right up? <gasps> Tipper! I'm seeing all of the black and white villagers, but not the ones that I need. Tipper! Not Tipper. Not all the cows. Ever since the Naomi drama, I don't like any of the cows. I'm over them. I'm over them. I don't want to see them anymore. I don't want to see them. I don't want to see them. I don't want to look. I don't want to look at them. I don't want to think about them. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. What if I just didn't do it? What if I just didn't do it? Tipper, don't even know her. Literally, who is that woman? I don't know who she is. Who's that? Who's Naomi? Like <laughs> Naomi. <laughs> I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. What was May's villager? Peewee. Who's that? I didn't see Peewee actually, so I have no beef with Peewee. I have no beef with Peewee. So. Another cow. <laughs> Do you think I'm gonna see another cow now? I don't wanna. What if I saw, I, what if I don't? What if I could just not? What if I could see it's someone green? Excuse me. Wow, the Joy Cons. Excuse me. Excuse me. It's Quilson. Um, not my fave. I got Fauna on my sixth nook, nook nook ticket and I decided to take her. Is she nice? I've never had Fauna. I like Fauna. I think Fauna's cute. I think she's a little baby. Does everyone agree with me? Perhaps not, but I think Fauna is just a little baby. She's just a little baby. That's all. Yeah, I think Kato would disagree, but I like her. I like her. So it's fine. I've never had Fauna, actually, though. I don't think I've had any of the... No, lies. I had Bam. I've had Bam. I don't think I've had any of the other deer. <gasps> Fauna is all right. You prefer deer draw? <gasps> really? Wow. I like Diana. I think she's. Oh, I've had Fuchsia too. Not me forgetting all of my villagers. 
I'm at Diane, uh, Fuchsia, the pink one, the pink one. Deirdre is based off of an IRL species. Oh, that's cute. I like her though. I think she's different. She's different. I think she's different. I have the Fauna plushie. Can they come out with plushies for all of them? Because imagine me with a Walker plushie. I'd be unstoppable. I'd be unstoppable. Okay. Is it Sherry? I, everyone's so mean about Sherry. Um, she's allowed to have yellow hands without it being associated with urine. Okay. I don't know. I don't know why we just said, okay, she's got yellow hands. It means it's pee. It's not. She, the color yellow is beautiful. Okay. This is the best monkey in the game. She is my original starter villager. I love her and I will take no slander. Okay. Zero slander. Yellow is a beautiful color and it does not need to mean pee, okay? Because what if I called, what, who's a villager everyone likes that has, like, okay, so Fauna is brown. What if I was like, poop hands? It's, yellow doesn't mean pee, brown doesn't mean poop, okay, guys? All right? God. <laughs> Tammy is yellow. I don't love Tammy, but. <laughs> I like Sherry. Uh, it's the species she's based on that actually does it, but let's call her... Wait, what? The... Wait, sorry. The the monkey species she's based off of, they pee on their hands? Then retract everything I say. Retract everything I say. Raymond isn't black nor white. He's gray. Oh, I tried to zoom in, but I forgot that's not actually on the screen. It's gray scale, black, white, and gray. He's gray. Gray. Look, man, hope you're doing good. <laughs> Squirrel monkeys wash their hands and pee. Oh, okay. Well, then I then retract my statement. I don't know anything. <laughs> I just was like, why do they call her pee hands? Just because she's got little yellow hands. Just kidding. I don't know anything. <laughs> JK, JK. Yeah, Goldie isn't a pee. Wait, Goldie's not yellow. I don't want it. Mm, it's okay. Well, what what does Goldie look like? Is Goldie not beige? Is Goldie not beige? There are so many black and white villagers not listed. It's because it's rodents. It's black and white. Oh, that's the wrong button. Black and white, black and white rodents. Except for the one cat and the one dog. <laughs> we need a cat and a dog to chase the rodents. That's black and white rodents. There's not that, there wasn't that many options. <laughs> there wasn't that many options, but we made it work. She's like a butter color. Okay, well, I would call butter yellow. I don't know anymore. This game has made me question every... Oh, it's someone... Was it Doby? <gasps> Was it Doby? We kicked Doby off the list. It's Doby! Oh, uh, we kicked Doby off the list. Leanne, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for being a sloth. We kicked him off the list. I can't put him back on the list. I want Walker. I want Walker, but we're going to pretend we didn't see Doby, okay? We didn't see him. We didn't see him. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. Goodbye. Goodbye. I think most people say Sherry has pee fans doesn't know that fact. Okay, that's what I was thinking too. I was like, I think they just say that because her hands are yellow. Get the graphic right, pay. I clicked because of my stream deck, I... I I didn't break it. I just, it updated and I forgot to fix some of the buttons. And so some of the buttons don't have um, the correct photos on them anymore. <laughs> so I just, I'm, I just try, I, some of them still have the text of what it is, but some of them I just click and hope for the best. <laughs> some of them I just click and hope for the best. Cranky Villagers might be the best. I mean, I mean, that's one way to think. Absolutely. And I do love a cranky villager, but there's something about a little lazy villager. There's something about a little lazy villager that just does it. Ooh, I need to devote time to my stream deck. Should I get it? Okay, steam deck or different things. We've got stream decks and steam decks. This. Stream deck. This. Life-changing.
This is great. I love this. I don't remember how I used to stream before this. This thing is great. Steam Deck. Also phenomenal, amazing. I don't have it in this room. It's in the other room. It's in the other room. Steam Deck, amazing. There will be a video about it soon. I don't have the Animal Crossing guidebook. I don't. I probably should. I feel like I'm the target audience for it, but I don't. Flip is not my favorite of the monkeys. He's not. He's not my favorite. Anyway, um, what was I just gonna say? Sorry? What was I gonna say? What was I saying? I don't remember. I don't, it wasn't it was something stupid probably. I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, lazy villagers. They're so cute. <laughs> That was my deep, insightful um, comment. No, I was talking about the la the lazy villagers. They were really cute. Yeah, Steam Deck button pressing machine. S what? Stream Deck button pressing machine. But button pressing machine. Steam Deck. Con video game console. Also, arguably a button pressing machine. Different, they're both good. They are both good button pressing machines. <laughs> both of them are good. Uh, you can press buttons on them and things happen. I did not purchase either of these items though, admittedly. My boyfriend gifted me the Stream Deck for our anniversary last year. And the Steam Deck I got for Christmas from my parents. So thank you so much for all the stuff. Um, Sherb is an absolute baby. Sherb is a baby. I agree. Hi, Feliciana. Hope you're doing good. Eric is my favorite villager and Sherb. Both good ones. Both good ones. I just got an extremely rare stuffed animal I've been looking for. Oh my God, I love that. I'm so toxic because I love watching people's... Um, like squishmallow hunting vlogs. I can't put more stuffed animals in this room, so I can't buy them. So I live vicariously through the other people. Amanda Louise, welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Let's be real, every device is a button pressing machine. Accurate. <gasps> is Jen still here? Jen, come get your boy. Jen, come get your boy. Look at your boy. It's your little, it's your friend. It's just a baby. It's just a baby. It's just a baby. I love him. I've never had him. I've never had Philbert. Not for this island, but for some island. Little me and little Philbert, my buddy. I'm gonna, guys, you know what I don't have planned? After this island is done and the hard mode island is done, I have no themes. My themes, gone, done. I don't have a theme. We're nowhere close to being done with either island, so. I don't have any other ideas though. My ideas have expired. <laughs> My ideas have expired. Your baby, your baby, your baby, your baby, your baby. You're right. Where's my baby? Where's Walker? Where's my baby? Where's mine? Where is he? 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 Guys, thank you for almost 150 likes. Oh my goodness. I appreciate it so much. There are so many of you here. What are you all doing? Is it anyone's first stream? If it is your first stream, can you put a heart in the chat? If it's your first stream, can you put a heart in the chat? If you've been here, you could put a sloth in the chat. If you've been here, you could put a sloth in the chat. But if you're, I'm just curious and nosy. If it's your first stream, keep a heart in the chat. I want to say hi. I want to say hi. Audi. My baby is Goldie or Sherb. Both very good. <gasps> is it Drea? Hi, welcome in. First stream, I liked it so. Ah, nice to meet you. Thank you for being here. Thank you so much. Lots of slots. Crystal, hi. It's nice to meet you. Hello. Hello. It's so nice to meet you. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you so much. I appreciate you so much. Look at all the slots. <laughs> I've been here, but I lurk. Jenny, hi. I love all the lurkers. Thank you. Thank you to everyone who lurks. I I don't know how often I talk in people's chats anymore, but I, 
I should. I should. I lurk a lot. I lurk a lot and then like their stream is over and I'm like, I didn't ever say hi. I need to talk more. I need to talk more. I need to I need to talk more. I get a little, you know. I get a little, I get a little nervous sometimes. I get a little shy. I get a little, sh I get a little shy. I get a little shy sometimes. But I'm always lurking. In fact, there are many times that um I need to start watching people on Twitch. I feel like there are so many times in the day more recently, I'm like, oh, perfect. I'm gonna sit down and eat my lunch. Let me turn on a stream and then no one's streaming. And then no one's streaming. And I'm like, oh. I should watch people stream on Twitch. So many of my friends are starting to stream on Twitch. I should go on Twitch and watch people stream. I just, it's still new to me. That's Aurora. She's super cute. Do you all watch Twitch streams? Do you, be honest, be honest with me. Do you watch them? Do you watch them as much as you watch YouTube streams too? I'm curious because I always watch YouTube. Always, always. I've never ventured onto Twitch. I, I have, but obviously I watch, I watch several people on Twitch. But they're usually people, everyone I watch on Twitch are people that I know because of their YouTube videos. <laughs> Either I know them because of their YouTube channel, but they stream on Twitch, so then I'll watch their Twitch streams, or I know them from Sabotage League and they stream on Twitch and then I see them. But I don't often just like, I don't often like, okay, it's in the middle of the day and I have some time and I wanna watch a stream and nobody's streaming. I don't often just like go onto Twitch and click on somebody who I don't know, which I should, I should. I wanna meet new friends. I always just go from the people I already know. I never just like go on Twitch and then click on, oh, who's this person? They're playing this game that I like. Why, why, why don't I, why don't I do that? I hate all the ads, that's fair, that's fair. I can't watch uh, Twitch streams. I only like watching YouTube streams. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Only watch Twitch for Stress Sabotage League, yeah. <laughs> I was like me, that's how I started watching Twitch was um, Sabotage League streams. But yeah, I mostly watch just people who I know from YouTube, but if they stream on Twitch. But a couple of my friends have started to stream more on Twitch and I want to still watch and support their content. But I just don't watch Twitch so frequently. So I gotta like get better about it. Have you seen people are playing Animal Crossing on TikTok Live? I have, I have. I don't know how you, um, I don't know how people stream on TikTok. I don't understand. And people stream on TikTok with multi-stream. So I could be streaming to you all this on YouTube, but I could also somehow be streaming it on TikTok if, there was, if I could figure out how to do it. I don't think I, I don't know. It makes me nervous because TikTok, I feel like I get a lot more, um, TikTok is a lot scarier for me, but also I feel like people, I, I think some, I don't know if people still do it, but I, there was a time where I saw a lot of people doing multi streams on YouTube and Twitch at the same time. So it would be like this stream you're watching right now would also be on Twitch. And so I would be responding to both you guys and also the Twitch chat. And I, that gives me, I can't do it. I can't multitask enough. It's already hard enough to talk, play the game and talk to the, the one chat. I feel like trying to interact with both chats, I couldn't do it. I'd be, t I couldn't do it. But shout out to the people who do that. Cause I, it, it's a good way to optimize your, um, content output um but i my brain can't do it <laughs> my brain can't do it uh eleanor thank you for being a member for two months i always give your channel to people that want to watch animal crossing new horizons content oh thank you so much i appreciate that thank you thank you thank you i appreciate that so much i like that twitch is interactive more with the channel points yeah i don't um i yeah yeah they have like a lot of cool integrations I love and I so wish that if YouTube had like the Amazon Prime thing, that'd be so cool. Where you can get like a free month of membership for someone for just having like Amazon Prime or something. That's so cool that they have that. I never watched the TikTok live comments, so scary. I couldn't, like I, 
I, I can't. I can't. Because then I would have to have mods moderate that too. It's already too, it's too much. But there are some people who will just stream on TikTok and then nothing else. Um, and I think that makes sense. But I think for me, it, I don't know. Like I've seen a lot of people jump over to Twitch too. I think for me, because I make, I would say I make a decent amount of video content. I feel like it just makes the most sense for me to be here. And I've already established my streaming on here. So I feel like for me, it doesn't make sense to multi-stream or to do different ones at this point. But yeah, I get why, I get why people do though. I totally get it. I need to be better about like making more stuff on my other platforms. Like I post TikToks. I really want to make my goal next month to try and like make my Instagram pretty. <laughs> I want to, how do I, how I just, I'm a cozy, I'm a cozy game lady, but I'm not an aesthetic cozy game lady. And I, it's not about the aesthetics, but like, I see all these like beautiful Instagram posts and I'm like, how do they do it? Like, how do they like curate everything so beautifully? I hate Alfonso. <laughs> hate him. Hate him. Hi, Brenda. How are you, Peyton and chat? Um, how are you? I'm doing good. Just noticed you hit 10K. Let's go. I did. Thank you so much. Says the three, four live streams, three to four videos. Ah, uh, the last couple weeks, I've only done one video a week. <laughs> but it worked out for me, actually. I don't know why. When I only made one video a week, the videos did significantly better than normal. <laughs> so it ended up, like, making up for it. It was, like... the. The couple times I did one video a week, those videos did the average of like, well, 10 of my videos. So I was like, all right, I don't feel too bad. I didn't feel too bad. I worked on it. And I've been just trying to pace myself, just trying to pace myself and, uh, you know, just make what I want to make when I want to make it. Still doing at least a video a week, but not stressing out if I can't do more than that. Because I do, yeah, I make, I make shorts too. I used to make them every day. Now I'm less, but I, I feel like I post a decent amount of content. Um, I'm happy with the amount of content I put out. Happy with it. Especially being someone who has a full-time job. If I didn't have a full-time job, I would be making way more content. But I do. I love that you're doing this theme. I had this idea a while ago. It's amazing you're trying it. Ah, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Welcome and welcome in. I have a planner slash stationary Instagram. Ooh, my tip is to choose one color, to choose my one color and one effect for it, and it'll be gorgeous. See, for me, I feel like I just like too many things. Like, I feel like, you know, my you can tell like uh, colors that I like just look like my stuff, like bl like blues and pinks, and I'm not um, I'm not the like, I don't know, like people have like very um all like white setups like where their desk is white their chair is white everything is like pristine that's not me i like color i like pastel colors but i also like beige and green too like i see the very like natural setups where people have like beige and green oh, i love it sorry if this is a weird question do your coworkers watch your streams and they have no idea that i do this <laughs> they have z uh, unless you do uh they have zero idea that i do this no not a clue <laughs> But I work from home, so I, I don't really um, talk to my coworkers. They all work in person, and I'm, like, the only one that works from home. So um, I probably am, like, an enigma to them. They they know my name and that I have endometriosis, and that's why I work from home. <laughs> I think that's it, though. Um, go for the rainbow? Yeah. I think, like... I, I think you, I might try to experiment this week with trying to take some like pretty setup be pictures because I would like I'm coming to the this point now which I talked about on our last podcast episode but it's um I'm I'm sometimes I struggle with like what games to feature on the channel and especially because I very kindly get sent I get sent games to play now too I don't always want to make games I don't want to make content about every single game like some games I don't feel like I can really make a whole video about or they're not long enough to make a stream about. 
but I still want to tell you about the game and share it with you. So I see so many people who make like Instagram reviews, like mini Instagram reviews for games that they've played. And I would love to do that. I just don't know how to like make everything look beautiful. <laughs> I don't know how people like, they. It, it's like the, the photo looks so simple. It's like someone with a switch, whatever game they're telling you about, they usually have like a draped blanket and like a pretty candle or like a cup of coffee. And it's all just like, organized so beautifully and perfect and I just don't know how to do that I feel like I've tried I I'll give it I'll give it a go I love to look at that kind of stuff I just can't make it yet okay flip again <laughs> I don't know how people do it I don't know how they do it but I love it like I love looking at people who have like such clear aesthetics like there's a couple Instagram people that I follow that they always use the same like I guess like presets or filters on their stuff. So it just always looks like everything is a part of this like very beautiful artistic space. And I'm like, oh, how do you do it? How do you do it? I could have a natural pastel aesthetic. I, um, so funny enough. Yeah, I might like redo my stuff. I, I've been saying for a long time, like, oh, I won't like redo my desk and stuff unless we ever move. But I don't think we're ever gonna move from this apartment anytime soon. So I feel like I should make my space a little bit nicer for myself. So, and by that I mean just, I can optimize it to be a little bit more organized. And we found um, an, a monitor, like someone was getting rid of an extra monitor. And I don't have the room to have the monitor, the third monitor on this desk the way it is. So, I'm going to try and look at it to see if I can maybe like save up for a new desk and then have a three monitor situation and then redo, like make some shelves and stuff. I don't know, make it like all pretty. I don't know. Lexi, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it so much. Welcome in raiders. Hello, hello, hello. Hope you're doing so good. Hi, Shiver. Hi, Megs. Hi, Emily. Hope you're doing so good. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate it so much. Uh, Kelly, hello. Welcome in. Thank you for the raid. How was your stream? What were you doing? Welcome to the corner. My name is Peyton. It's nice to meet you all. It's nice to see you all. Today, we are working on my brand new island, which is a entirely black and white grayscale island that is an old Holly... This is so... Um, it is an old Hollywood crime mafia movie gone wrong featuring exclusively rodents except for one cat and one dog. Today's stream, we're doing a little villager hunting. We're doing a little island planning. We're having a good time. We're glad you're here. Welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. I mean, Iona was talking about how she sh uh, how she shared the way she played games on the couch like a goblin and with a TV on. And a lot of her viewers were happy to see a content co content creator play the way they do. Yeah, like I just I talked about this. Um, I don't know if it was on the regular stream or one of the member streams, but um, maybe Salem made an amazing video recently about like like the TikTokification of cozy gaming and how everything is trying so hard to be aesthetically pleasing and beautiful and it really did like hit me because I definitely want to make like I see all of like the beautiful Instagram cozy game stuff and I want to make that stuff I'm like oh I I love it but it feels so hard for me to make it um because it just feels like I I'm not like a very um I don't know like I'm, I'm like kind of all over the place a little bit and everything is messy and I live in I don't live in like a beautiful huge space where I have the most extravagant setup where I have all the room for all the pretty decor. It's like, I have so much cute stuff and I'm so appreciative of it, but I live in like a tiny apartment. It's all squished together and it looks crazy and I can't take cute pictures of it. And um, yeah, I don't know, just trying to find a way to like be myself, but also like, you know, make something pretty. <laughs> be myself, but also like make something pretty. Hi Stella, welcome in, hope you're doing good. Hi Carter, hi Pineapple, hi everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh no, Lexi, I'm so sorry about that. I hope that you are all right. I'm sending you all of the love. I hope that stream was okay before that though. And we're sending you all the good vibes. Sending you all the good vibes. Yeah, it is realistic. I want to find a way to um, make cute Instagram pictures. <laughs> cute Instagram pictures and maybe like game reviews, but also keeping it like fun and like, you know, put some sloths in the background. It's not going to all be pretty candles and stuff. Lorraine! Thank you for upgrading your membership. Can we get some hearts and hype in the chat for Lorraine? Welcome to Silly Sloth. I appreciate it so much. 
Mitch. Thank you, Lorraine. Can we get some hearts and hype in the chat, please? I appreciate it so much. Guys, thank you for all the member love today. <laughs> I appreciate it so much. We've gotten 12 new members today and like a million people using their membership milestones today. So thank you all so much for the love and support. It means the entire world. And um, I'm so glad to have you guys in the squad. I'm so glad to have you in the squad. And also just a reminder, we changed this. <laughs> we changed this. Now the goal is to just get back to 400 members. And if we get to 400 members, we'll do the paint and sip stream. And then I can't confirm nor deny, but the last goal might be happening anyway since we hit 10K. But you didn't hear that from me. You didn't hear that from me. You yeah, didn't hear that from me. Didn't hear that from me. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, to sum it up, I was already having a hard time and then a bunch of glitches and tech issues. Oh no, we were having such bad tech issues here too. We were having such, did someone tell Iona that I was literally fangirl? Stop, did someone tell Iona that I literally like 10 minutes ago was like, yeah, I have a couple people I'm like a huge fangirl over and Iona is like my number one. <laughs> Congrats on 10K queen, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. How are you? Welcome in, welcome in. <laughs> <laughs> I was saying like 10 minutes ago, I was, um, I was just fangirling over you. Just, I was just fangirling over you a little bit. I was like, Iona is just the queen of my queens. Don't fan over me. I'm eating snacks in a corner of my bed like a gremlin. And that's exactly what I want. And that's like, that's what it is. How are you? I hope you're doing so good. Guys, I know you're subscribed to Iona. I, I know you are. I know you are. I know you are. I know you are. But if you're not, fix it. Oh God, fix it. Please, please. Iona stuff is the best. Iona gets me excited about games that I know I would probably never play. Iona plays so many different kinds of games. I don't play that many different kinds of games, except now that I'm loving Bayonetta Origins and I'm a combat queen, maybe I will go and play all of the games. But Iona has a way of getting you excited about any game ever, any game ever. And that's like, who knew No Man's Sky could be a cozy game? I didn't, <laughs> I didn't, I didn't. I love the sorority of cozy game streaming. What, what is a sorority? Welcome to, um, what's like, a, what, what's like a sorority name we can make up? Like, I don't, what, uh, what, I don't know anything about, they do like those letters, they do like, Alpha, Sigma, da -da 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 -da. I don't know what any of it is. <laughs> I don't know what any of it is. Thank you all for the love, I'm just not having a good night right now. I'm so sorry, Lexi, we're sending you all of the love. I hope that it gets better, and it is the first day of spring. It is the first day of spring. We've got a whole spring. We've got a whole spring. So, you know, Sometimes I get the you get the blues with the new season, but I feel like it's gonna be a good spring. I hope it's a good spring for you. I know you're. Are you not a Taurus too? Is your birthday coming up? You're a Taurus. Birthday season is among us. Birthday season is among us. Good things are gonna happen. Good things are gonna happen. I believe in it. <gasps> Cozy KS Crew CCC for short. I love that. Oh, I love that. Yeah, that's it. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. Perfect. 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 Birthday's May 9th. Yeah, Cancer. Or no, haha. -ha. I was reading Michelle who said they were Cancer. Taurus. I'm the 21st. I'm an April Taurus, but we're not. Can you believe it's almost April? I cannot. I cannot. I'm sad my allergies are really bad. Oh no. I have. It's funny. So I have like uh, tree pollen allergies, but I live in Brooklyn now. So they have not been as bad as when I lived in. um rural New Jersey <laughs> uh, as when I lived in rural New Jersey uh what you know you're a Sagittarius let's go let's go let's go what's the most we were talking about this some other time what do you think is the most common sign is there is there a statistic on which one is the most common because I feel like I don't know that many Taurus but I feel like it's not the least common you're January 30th. Let's go. Leo, Gemini, Sagittarius too. Libra, my boyfriend's a Libra. My boyfriend's a Libra. May 4th, so you're a Taurus as well. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 
Let's go, Capricorn. Dom. Okay. Hi, Dom. Okay. You're. But you know what? I. I guess I don't have any perception on life because this is like a, a bunch of you are saying you're a Taurus. This is like how I think I've only realized recently how many of you are also chronically ill and cute. Because I'm. Um, you know, like we say we're chronically ill and cute on this channel. We're chronically ill. Beautiful, fabulous. And like, I know I'm aware that people watch and they're like, I'm chronically ill and cute too. I don't think I realized how many of you are also chronically ill until recently. And now I'm like, my person, I just, I don't know why I just thought I was by myself over here. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not by myself over here. We're all partying together. We're all partying together. Lots of Leos, yeah. Lots of Leos, lots of Cancers. I'm a, I'm a double Cancer. I'm a Taurus, Cancer Moon, Cancer Rising. Mm. Not exactly a chronic illness, but I do have a heart problem. Sounds chronically ill and cute to me. People have asked me before, they're like, can I call myself chronically ill and cute if I just have like migraines? And I'm like, yes, I say so. I'm not the chronic illness gatekeeper. <laughs> I am actually not the chronic illness gatekeeper. I'm like, if it resonates with you, you're in the club. I love Rodeo. Rodeo is kind of my dude. He's kind of my dude. Kind of my dude. Aquarius? I feel like, is Aquarius not as common? I don't know that many Aquarii. Aquarii. I don't know what uh, my big brother is. His birthday is November 1st. Scorpio. Scorpio? Is that right? Is that right? Is that right? Also chronically ill. Let's go. We all have problems, but we're cute. We all have problems, but we're cute. We all have problems. I had a surgery for at one years old, but it's not fully resolved. Oh no. Oh gosh. I'm so sorry. I'd say chronically ill and cute. I'm sending you all the love. I hope everything's all right. Chronically ill and cute has changed my whole mindset about my chronic illness. I love it so much. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad that that is the that is the purpose because I often feel bad about mine. You know, I'm not perfect. Like I said, um, yesterday I like went out in the world. Like I cosplayed as a normal person. <laughs> I cosplayed as a normal person yesterday, and I went to like Manhattan. I went to like go shopping, like go out to eat, and, like tried to be like a normal person. And I was in excruciating pain on the way there. And I was just crying. I just like hysterically cried on the subway because I was like in a lot of pain, but I was just letting myself, ooh, sorry. I was just letting myself be upset that I was in pain and telling myself like, oh, it's always gonna be like this when you try and go out. When that's not true, um, it just happened to be like that that day. And also I don't go out that much. So like big shocker, your first time going out in a while, it didn't go that well. Um, so yeah, it's, it's helped me a lot because I, as much as I try and be very positive about it online, I do have a lot of days where, you know, I wake up and I'm in pain and I'm like, oh, I don't feel cute. So saying it just kind of helps me feel like it's, um, not so bad. It's not so bad. You know, it's not so bad. It's whatever. It's cute. It's there. All right, you know? Hello, lion man. Hello, lion man. Um, Taurus and chronically ill and quite possibly cute? No, definitely cute. No, the the cute isn't the question here. The cute, the, the ev all, I, I, everyone's cute, mind you. All of you are cute. Every single one of you is cute. Okay, not all of you are chronically ill, but that's okay. You, that's okay. That's okay. But I can pinky promise you're all cute. You're all cute. You're all cute. <laughs> you're all cute, and I appreciate you all being cute with me. Be cute together. You know? You know, you know? What time is it, by the way? Okay, I'm gonna do... Let's do... We're at 70 tickets. Let's do five more and then let's move on. <laughs> and then let's move on to planning the villager lore, the map, and the other stuff we have to do today. The other stuff we have to do today. 
We didn't find anyone. I mean, we did have such good luck last time, though. So it's fine. It's not the end of the world, but. Yes, please don't put your age in the chat. All the love, all the love. I don't want to know. But I don't want to know. Uh, is it Demo? Hello. Welcome in. Good morning on this Tuesday morning just subbed. Good morning. Hello. It's nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Thank you for being here. And Gabriella, hello. Hi, Peyton. Hi. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. I hope you're doing great. I hope you're having a good day. He's a bird. It's um Jacob. I like Jacob. I think he's cute. Oh, I think he's very cute. I think he's a cute little bird. I've never had him. Never had it. I've never had most villagers. I mean... How many islands have I done? Not that many. Like seven? You're still sick? No! You're not allowed to be sick. Pineapple mango, not allowed to be sick. I decree it's time to, for you to feel better. I'm sending you good vibes. I'm sending you tea. I'm sending, if you like tea. <laughs> I'm sending you relaxation. I'm sending you a comfy blanket. And I'm sending you a Nintendo Switch and a dream. And I hope you feel better soon. I move in four months, so I started packing. Oh, I hate what's worse, packing or unpacking? What do you think is worse? Packing or unpacking? I don't know what's, um, packing is worse. Unpacking is fun, because you get to pick where things go. You think unpacking is worse? Unpacking is worse. I think packing is worse. I Because unpacking, like, you get to pick where things go, you know? Congrats on 10K, by the way. Well-deserved. Thank you. I appreciate it. I still can't believe it. I still... People have been saying it all stream. So, like, I... And I'm, like, aware. I am I am aware that it happened. Um, But I continuously... I continuously have not processed... I know I had my whole, like, speech in the beginning. Um, Becky! I love Becky. I've continued to not process it... We've made jokes about now we're considered um, micro-influencers. So now we're a micro-sloth. <laughs> um, but I still haven't actually processed it as it's... Um, I never thought we would get anywhere near this point. And the fact that, like, we kind of sped run. We, 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 it, was like a, it was like a steady... It was like a steady channel progression... But then ever since 6K, it's been like a speed run to the end. And um, it has been crazy. And I have not processed any of it. <laughs> and I have not processed any of it. And um, I just feel really excited that you're all here. The way I start processing it is like I see new people in the chat. And I'm like, hi. Um, or like I see new comments. Or like people will comment and like, I just found your channel. Or... People will be like, I love your videos. And I'm like, you watch my videos? <laughs> it's it's cool. Um, hi, just joined. Congrats on the news this morning. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I appreciate it so much. Unpacking takes me so long. Yeah, I get that though. I feel like it's a lot of effort, but I still think packing is worse. I still think packing is worse. Sarah, hello, welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Stacy, you didn't miss anything. You didn't miss nothing. We're villager hunting for a couple more tickets. And then we're going to go to our, <gasps> is it Hugh? Is it baby? <gasps> oh my God. I love this man. I love this man so much. He was my first ever lazy villager. I love him. I love him so much. He's my baby. Do I have this? This is potato park. I have like all the, I have most of the DIYs. Archer, thank you for being a member for two months. 10K, that's amazing. Congrats, pay well deserved. Thank you, Archer. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, well, I'm gonna drop this. <laughs> I have it, I have it, I have it. Um, yeah, I'd say mental illness counts as chronically ill and cute too. You could say mentally ill and cute. I think the alliteration isn't as good, so I would say chronic illness is still good. We could say mentally ill. And I feel like mighty isn't as good as cute. What's like, what's a synonym for cute that's with an M? Mentally ill and magnificent? Magical? Mesmerizing? Mesmerizing? Oh, I like that. Marvelous? That too. 
that too. Oh, I mean, you got to 10K. I did. That, that did happen. That did happen. Um, unless we're still asleep and it's all been a dream. Unless that it's all been a dream. <laughs> uh, unless it's all been a dream. It could be. Could be. I'm still asleep. I'm still in my bed. Sleepy sleepies. We got the sleepy sleepies. Got the sleepy sleepies. You know? Yeah, that, that did happen. Um, but you didn't miss it. It happened off stream. The, the past few have all happened off stream. I was kind of hoping this one would happen on stream, but it just yesterday, it was like, oh, Molly, <gasps> baby, just a baby, just a baby, just a baby. Yeah, it did, it did happen on stream, but we, we got to celebrate. We'll celebrate next week. We're gonna have a big party. We're gonna have a little big little party, a big little party. Gotta go be productive and try a thing. Best of luck in the hunt. And again, congrats. Artsy, thank you for being here. All the love. Have a great rest of your day slash night. Good luck with all the video making. Good luck with all the video making and productivity things. And all the productivity things. You're eating supper now. What's for dinner? What's for dinner? A micro party? <laughs> Not a nano party. Oh, we're having a micro party. <laughs> We're having a micro party. Oh. Welcome to our VIP micro influencer party. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm dead. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. Chicken and wild rice, car uh, carrots and celery. All of those things sound delicious. All of those things sound really good. My last two live streams were hard mode. Nice, you completed all of the fossils and got four photos. You're killing it, doing better than me. My hard mode island is in shambles right now. Like, <laughs> not quite popular for a proper party? No. <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> Ooh, having some chips and salsa. Oof, I could go for some like chips and queso. I could go for some chips and queso. Genj, okay, wait. Everybody, I need, okay. We discovered this the other day. I don't mean to start drama, but this was insane to me the other day. Um, what color is this villager? Everyone, what color is this villager? This is Genji, by the way. I just need to make sure I'm not crazy because in the member stream, we ran into a debate. Okay. <gasps> Guys, guys, let me go close. I don't have a vault. Do I have a vaulting wall? The main question here isn't if he's cream or white. The question is, is his ears and his feet black or brown? Because on my members control my live stream, we played a game where I had to not look at the villagers, guess who they were and then draw them. And everyone said black and white rabbit. And they said black and white jock. So I knew it wasn't Dottie. And I was like, there isn't a black and white rabbit. And I was like, do you guys mean Genji? Who is like chocolate brown and white? And everyone's like, yeah. And I was floored. Oh, you guys are split on it too. But look at his little feet. Wait, look at his little feet. Look at his little feet. His feet are like a little ombre. Look, like he's got like a little ombre. The chocolate brown to the lighter brown. He is a brown and white rabbit to me. But I, I, I'm not here to start drama. I just had, this was a color debate I hadn't heard before. I was like, we discover them over here. <laughs> we discover them over here a little bit, huh? His feet are gradient, but still black and white. False, false. His eyeliner is black, but his ears are clearly brown. Yeah, to me, it's like, that's the color of my hair. My hair is dark brown. My hair is dark brown. But it's all good. It's all good. It's all right. Thought it was interesting. I thought he was black and white, but then after you zoomed in, definitely looks white and brown. That's what I said. That's what people said the other day too. They're like, from afar, I thought black and white. But then I zoomed and I was like, look at the feet. I was like, look at the feet. 
you know? My hair is black brown. My hair looks darker on camera. My hair is um, like a medium brown. My hair is like a medium brown. Hey, I need to know your input. When you customize a stall, is it the light brown option? Is the light brown actually light brown or is it yellow? Um, ooh, I don't think I've used the light brown stall in a second. I feel like I always have the dark brown. It is yellowy, but I, I would still call it light brown, but it, I think it's like, I think it's a little yellowy. There's some, there's some like medium tone browns in this game that look orange to me. Like there's sometimes like, it'll be like wooden table and then it'll be like, like dark wooden table and it'll be orange. My mom, what did I just read 10K? Yes, yesterday, can you believe it? I was out shopping while it happened. Hi mom, how are you? Welcome in, welcome in, hope you're doing good. I don't know, I don't know what color theory is. I don't know what it is. What do I know? Murphy, what a ba what you, what you baby? just a baby he's just a baby he's just a baby okay we're gonna do one more ticket and then we will um stop hunting and we're gonna get into island planning island planning i promise <laughs> i would have liked to get a villager but okay it's all right we got so many last time so i can't be greedy murphy's your birthday twin let's go i like murphy i think he's very cute i think he's very sweet i think he's a cute little bear I think he's really nice and he's underrated. I think. Thank you guys for 170 likes, by the way. I appreciate it so much. Thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. I hope you guys have all had, is it Monday? Oh, we're doing this again. Oh, what are we doing tomorrow? I don't know yet. We're streaming tomorrow morning, but I don't know what we're gonna do. I had, I had one thing planned for tomorrow, but I think I'm changing my mind. I think I'm changing my mind. I don't know yet. Stay tuned. But I'm streaming at 8 a.m. tomorrow. I don't know what though, yet. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. When I make the thumbnail after this stream, we'll see what my heart desires for tomorrow. Um, how many ten? How many subscribers is 10K? 10,000. 10,000. My mom obviously had to pay you all to be here, right? My mom at Aunt Marina. We can't end on Marina, we're doing one more. Um, my mom obviously paid you all to be here. That's the only explanation. That's the only explanation. That's it. That's the only explanation I could think of, you know? <laughs> Even if my mom gave all of you a dollar though, that's $10,000. That's a lot. That's a, that's a lot of money. That's a lot. <laughs> Still waiting for your check. Um, yeah, it's on, it's on its way. You guys are getting paid. Are you, uh, are you getting paid? Is that why you subscribe to the channel? Are you? 10,000 is a lot of subscribers. They say it makes us a micro influencer. And that means we're micro sloths. And uh, that makes me feel cool. Where's the money? It's in the, your check's in the mail. Your check is in the mail. <laughs> your check is in the mail. I'm gonna also make, cause you don't get a YouTube plaque until you hit 100,000. That's too far and that's not my goal. I don't I don't have any other goals af after this. This was my goal, we hit it, yay. I'm beyond proud, I don't have any other goals. I'm gonna make a fake YouTube play button out of like cardboard and I'm gonna put it here. And it's gonna be our 10K cardboard play button. And I think that's cute. All right, that's Bianca. All right, no villager success today, but that's okay. Let's go back and let's uh, do some other stuff. Let's do some other stuff. <laughs> I think I think we should make a cute little, I think we should make a cute little cardboard. Make it, it'll be micro sized. It'll be this big. It'll be this big and it'll be right there. Uh, and it'll be perfect. And I'm gonna cover it in glitter. And, and I'm gonna cut it, cover it in glitter. <laughs> I'm gonna cover it in glitter and I'm gonna cry. And it'll be good. Okay, everyone. So in case you're new, this is the theme. It's an entirely black and white grayscale island. Old Hollywood mafia movie. 
but there's a real murder and there's real crime, but it's the rodent version. So they're all rats and rodents, except for Raymond and Walker, who I've already decided are like the detectives, but we need to figure out the lore for the rest of the island. We also need to plan out the map and start thinking of some items that we'll need to do. Pay, do you have any uh, end of the year goals for your channel? No. <laughs> Uh, no, mm -mm. I, my wild, my wildest dream was to hit 10k and that happened. So now I'm just like, there's nothing else. Like continue to make content that I'm proud of, continue to have a good time, continue to try new things. But as far as like numbers go, I'm not like, oh yeah, I want to hit 20k. No, I'm like. From this point on, whatever happens, happens. Like, if we get really close to something, I'll probably be like, oh my god, we're almost at blah, blah, blah. But I'm not like, yes, by the end of the year, I would like to do XYZ thing. I did way more than I already thought. I don't want to say that I deserved, but I, I feel like... It's been quite a bit. <laughs> it's been quite a bit. Um, All right. So, where's Roscoe? The... Rodent version. Rodents. Rodents. Rats. Squirrel. Hamster. Except for the one dog and the one cat. Rodents. Rodents. Okay. So let's come up with some villager lore, shall we? I think we shall. Let me pull this up. Let me pull this up really quick. Is it? It's window capture. Window capture is on what screen? Is Did I not put it on? It's Canva, Payton. You called it Canva is what you called it. Villager lore. Look at me with the screens. Okay. So we need to pick. Okay. We did this for the murder mystery island. And I think it was a lot of fun. So what we need to think about here is we need to think about it's it's like a film set. So some of them maybe are like, you know, someone's got to be like the star, like the starlet of the old movie. Raymond and Walker, I think I've already decided I want them to be the detectives, the real life detectives that are investigating this film set that's gone wrong. I feel like it just based off of their personalities, I feel like it makes the most sense for me. And of course, tell me that I'm wrong and I want to hear everyone's opinions. Um, I feel like Raymond is the more experienced detective and he's like the super tough one. And I think Walker is like the baby one. I think Walker is like the baby detective and he like doesn't know what he's he doesn't know what's going on, but he's happy to be there, you know? Um, we're going to say, like, experienced det detective is what we'll call it. Like, experienced detective. What role am I playing? I think maybe my character. I don't know. Whatever is left over, I don't want to say that my character is, like, the director. Because maybe we'll decide one of these people is the director. Because not all of them have to be actors. Like, they could be other people on the film set. So we've got our experienced detective. And our... I'm going to literally just say baby detective. <laughs> Walker is dumb in a good way. He's just a baby. He's just a baby. So I'm going to call him baby Baby in all caps. Baby. Oh, that's not all caps. Baby detective. Mm. Peyton's the main star. So I also have to think, well, we have to think about who died too. Similar to, <laughs> similar to our um, murder mystery island. I don't want it to be a villager that's died. Like maybe it's an NPC. So like someone had, someone died and that is what we're investigating, but it's in the context of this film set. Hi, Julie. I hope you're doing good. So who do we think is the star? I feel like I feel like we should do the like huge, huge movie star and like the newbie, the newbie who like wants to take her place. I feel like who do we think is the huge movie star and who is the one that wants to like get up in there? You know what I mean? Greta is the huge movie star. I'm... I'm in that realm. But I also think Tasha is the only squirrel. I feel like there's got to be something up with Tasha. She's the only squirrel here. She's unique. 
Tasha, the movie star, Bella, the newbie. See, Bella gives me like crew vibes. Bella gives me like, I'm operating the camera. <laughs> Bella is giving me, I'm operating the camera. Or I'm doing something. Gulliver died? Maybe. Someone died. Some, some NPC died. Some NPC that was like, I don't know. The love interest? Like, someone? <laughs> yeah, Tasha. Pay last comment. What did I miss? What did I miss? What if you were the original star that got killed so my character is a ghost? Could be that. Could be that. Could be that. I kind of like it, though. Mm. Billy gives stunt, just a stunt double, like body double. Dora looks like a newbie. Mm. I used to be a PA. Bella definitely gives crew vibes. Maybe Naomi was it. And they rest in peace to Naomi. I feel like... Yeah, maybe the, maybe the tagline was there was a different big star and we have two baby stars that are trying to like be the next. Maybe it's like, maybe the main star of the movie was killed. Whoever we decide that is like Naomi or like if we pick an NPC, if we pick like, not like Isabel uh, or something like that. Um, it's gotta be someone crazy. And we have... To recast the movie, we have to recast the movie and we have two people viable and it's Greta or Tasha. Greta or Tasha are like auditioning to be the replacement. And maybe one of them is more established and one of them, one, one of them is a more established actor that it like should go to. And like everyone just assumes like, oh, obviously it's going to go to them. But then there's like this new person that's like here to shake it up. So, ooh, I like it, but who do you think is who? Like, I, I like Tasha and Greta. Out of the two of them, who is giving, they are the bigger star. Who is the bigger star here? You know, between Greta and Tasha. Also, hi everyone coming in during this. I appreciate you all so much for being here. Tasha is giving you big star energy. Greta, Tasha. Tasha. I'm now seeing more Tasha's than Greta. Greta gives me more old school and Tasha's new. Oh my God, you guys are so split. Oh, should we do a poll? We're gonna do a poll. You guys are so split on this. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold up. Hold up, hold up. Let me do a poll really quick. You guys are divided. Who, who is the star? Sorry, it's in all caps. Who is the star? Tasha, Greta, okay? So both of them are in the running for the role, but who is the bigger, I can't believe we're doing this. <laughs> Sometimes I sit and like listen to myself as I'm talking about like my rodent movie star island and I'm like, what are we doing? Um, <laughs> in the best way, I'm like, what, what are we doing? Um, Cavs, Peyton, sometimes the keyboard is too many extra steps, you know? All right, Tasha's sweeping the pole by a landslide. Tasha is sweeping the pole by a landslide. Okay, so Tasha's the bigger star. So we're gonna say Tasha is the bigger star. Guys, hear me out. Greta makes more sense to be the established big star because everyone else looks like credit. So Tasha being the star is weird. What do you mean? Greta makes more sense. Oh, because she's the only squirrel. Oh, the po okay, we're good. It's evening out. There's only 47 votes and there is 124 people here. So let your let your voice be heard. Let your voice be heard. I mean, I guess for the lore, it does make sense if Greta is the more established star because the rest of them are all mice, except for Flurry. Tasha is the only squirrel. Tasha's winning the poll, though. Am I going to overrule the poll? Greta is a long-term star. Tasha is the newbie starlet. Yeah, I kind of like that. I kind of like that. I'm overruling the poll. <laughs> I'm overruling the poll. I think that I like that. 
Hi, ghost. I hope you're doing good. Yeah. A faded star. Yeah, I get that vibe from Greta. I get that. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do Greta is our... Um, and what... Who who died? Like, was it Naomi? Should we just have, like, pictures of Naomi everywhere? Because I think that'd be funny. Because Naomi does look like a movie star to me. And she's got beef on... Obviously, we've got beef, so it's, you know, the lore. Because we could do someone like, you know, a different villager like Monique or Tiffany. But I don't have any beef with them. I think it should be Naomi that died. Oh, uh, well, let's call her... Exper uh, Experienced actor. Or, yeah. Experienced actor. And then Tasha is like the up and coming, up and coming star. Up and coming actor. Oh, actor's fine too. Uh, I like star. That's more dramatic. Star is kind of more dramatic, and I'm extra, so. I like that. Up and coming star. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, this is so fun. Okay. I think Walker should be our co-star, though. Maybe Walker is... You know what would be cute for Walker? Because I do like him and Raymond as detectives. But what if Walker secretly wants to be an actor, but he's too shy? What if he, like, secretly wants to be an actor? That could also put him in the running for suspicion. Because, like, he's hanging around... Maybe he hangs around the film set because he wants to be an actor. But he's a detective. You know? His dream in life is to be the actor. Shy boy. He's a little baby boy. He's a real baby boy. He's a little baby boy. A wannabe... Actor. Okay. Wannabe actor. All right. Who? Marlo is the executive producer that funds the show through his mob ties. So then who? Okay. I'm, I hear you there. I'm with you there. So does that mean Hamfrey should be our leading man? Does that mean Hamfrey is our leading man? Is Hamfrey the leading man in this picture? Because I agree, Mar Marlo could be an actor, but he also does give me like, he's running the show. He's producing and directing it. No, so who's the, who's who should Hanfrey be then? By default, I'd say yes. I mean, I feel like we gotta have him in the movie. Gotta have him in the movie, right? We could come back to them too. Hanfrey is the assistant that gets yelled at. <laughs> Hanfrey is like the unpaid intern. <laughs> is Hanfrey the old unpaid intern? <laughs> Marlo, producer, director, and star? Oh, you think? Producer, director, and star? Hamfrey, the janitor? Oh my god. Heather, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for your sloth. I appreciate it. <laughs> not the janitor. You guys said Hamfrey's not allowed in the movie. Poor thing just getting coffee. Or should one of the or should one of the girls be an intern? Because not all of them could be in the movie. Should, like, Dora or Flurry be an intern? I feel like Dora or Flurry can give intern energy. And they secretly want to be a star, too. You know? Let's do, Mar uh, let's do Marlo first. Let's do Marlo first. So he is... I kind of like him being, um... Producer, director, and star. <laughs> I kind of do like that. Like, he's doing it all. All right, so we do producer, producer. Oh my God, Peyton, that's not how you spell. Producer, director, star. Okay. Um, Humphrey's the stunt double. <laughs> Dora for the intern. Dora is the intern. Oh, you all are saying Dora the intern. Okay. I like Dora the intern. The intern slash, like, PA. No? Okay. Let's do... 
Lurie could be Marlo's niece who's waiting for her big chance. Oh my God, that's so cute too. That's cute too. She's like the little Nepo baby. <laughs> <laughs> She's like the little Nepo baby that has a side part and she like is really bad at acting. Flurry is like the worst actor, but like she's just here because he promised her. Unpaid intern. Okay. Dora's the unpaid intern. Um, Flurry is also giving costume design. What about Bella and Petrie? What about Bella and Petrie? Because I feel like Petrie is also giving me like, Petrie is like doing something. <laughs> I feel like I like Flurry as the um bad, bad actor, Nepo baby. Bad act. <laughs> Petrie is the props master. What if Petrie is props and special effects? Yes! Ah, Ella said it right when I was saying it. Yes. I like that. I kind of like that. Bad actor, or not bad actor, haha. Special effects and props for Petrie. She's behind the camera. And then what? Is Bella the, um, the camera op? Is Does that make Bella the camera op? Who's operating the camera? Is it me? Am I the, am I operating the camera? Am I doing it? All right, let's do props and uh, special effects. Me, yes, I am. I'm filming the movie. <laughs> it's me. Okay. So wait, we were um we were divided about Hamfrey. We we're we were divided about Hamfrey. Hamfrey you all think is the janitor is what you guys were saying you guys think Humphrey's the janitor does Humphrey also want to be a star or is he just like Humphrey is extras number one to five <laughs> i'm dead i'm dead Humphrey for the janitor because he's trash you guys hate Humphrey, huh i like him as like a uh, the suspicious janitor you know, I like it. He could be a goofy sidekick, too. Do you think he's a, a janitor that, like, wants to be in the movie? Like, he tries to be in the background in the movie? He's not Rodney. He's not Rodney. Janitor. Is he a janitor with hopes and dreams? Janitor with hopes and dreams. <laughs> See, they all have a motive. They all have a motive. They all have a motive. Okay, and then that leaves Bella, who is giving tech energy, but what? The uh, janitor who got the job because he was stalking Naomi. <gasps> ooh, ooh, ooh. It's all, it's all heating up. It's all heating up. It's all heating up. They all have a motive right now, guys. It's looking good. It's looking good. So Bella, who is the victim? That we don't know. Oh, Naomi. Naomi was the original star of the movie and she was killed. Bella could be sound in music. Could be sound in music. Could be. Hair and makeup. Should we just say like, The crew, the crew member who does eight jobs. <laughs> Bella's the writer of the film who's being ignored. Hmm. I like it. I think I like that. I think let's combine it. She's the writer of the film being forced to do everyone else's job. Right? And she's doing everyone's job. I kind of like that. Writer. Writer who does everyone's job. I like it, guys. This is so fun. And then my character, my person, is the camera operator. And, um, yeah, that's me. I operate, I'm the cinematographer. Right, let me make this smaller. 
Okay. All right. That's our character lore. I like it. I like it. I say Hamfrey is the investor who keeps overstepping and using his money to try and control everyone. I feel like we don't think Marlo is producing it, though. I feel like Marlo is giving me he's funding it, but in sus ways, you know, a camera operative who's a budding Nancy Drew. That's me. You're right. You're right. All right, let's move on. Look at us being productive. See, I knew this wasn't gonna take the whole time. So I was like, we're gonna do this at the end. Okay, so um, this is just, the only thing I have mapped out is this little thing is where my resident services is. Um, then you just have this giant green square because I just, I didn't take an empty picture of my map. I just put a square over it. Um, my character should also do the makeup. I'm into that. I'm into that. Now, if you're new here, um, I like to terraform my maps into fun shapes. For this one, I already have, um, I have an idea in mind. So I wanna do a film clapper. Let me find one that's like the exact kind of, sh yeah, like this, like this. I wanna do a film clapper right in the center of the island. And by center, I mean, yeah, you know, like this or something, like big. This one is gonna have to be one all in pathing because I think this whole island is going to be um, like city style, city style and film set. So because of that, I don't think there's gonna be a crazy amount of terraforming. So we'll have to do this design in pathing that we cover, but we've done that before. I can see noodles, hello, congrats on 10K. Time flies, I remember when you hit 3K, hope you're doing good. Thank you so much. I'm doing great. I hope you're doing good. Um, having a good time. So there's this. And then my idea is to put a rat up top. Let me find like, this is a simple rat. I'm trying to use simple shapes. Donna, hello. Congrats on 10K. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Appreciate it so much. Thank you for being a part of it. Um, I think actually I like the rat here. I still don't understand how you come up with these ideas. It's it's based off of things you all say as a joke and then I take it seriously. <laughs> Angela, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for being a sloth. I think maybe we'll do it like make him bigger so that the, and then I'll make mine different. So maybe the, the tail won't hang this way. The tail will go like out toward like where resident services is. And then I also want, I want, um, this, hold on. This is so stupid. <laughs> this is so stupid um, and I love it. Emily, gotta go to bed. I hope the rest of the planning goes well. Congrats on 10K yet again, well deserved. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, And then I want a block of cheese. Should we have two blocks of cheese? Like we could do one here. All right, let's do. Maybe just like flat is good for it. And then like a baby one down here. I always am more ambitious when I do this than when we actually terraform it because sometimes these things are bigger than they are. So let's do that. And then something little around. I mean, my go-to is stars at this point. We could do like little stars around. Um, What if, wait. Guys, what if, what if I spell out rat wood across? What if I did, this is so dumb. This is so dumb. What if I, <laughs> um, what if I did like, like rat wood somewhere? Like maybe in the back, like it's the Hollywood sign. I may or may not have posted inspo. Nat, Nat, you're the best. Oh my God. You save me every island. Every island, you save me with the codes. Let's do rat wood across the back. Maybe it'll go all the way across the back. The, the, the scale isn't exact. The scale isn't exact, but you know, you, we get the idea. Okay, rat wood, and then maybe we'll do miscellaneous like stars and stuff throughout if we see that we have more room. Okay, so now what we need to do is figure out where things are actually going to go. 
Hmm, do I want to do that right now? Because the only other thing that I have is to think about the items that we need. Isn't as fun. That isn't as fun. So we have 10 houses. We have two shops. I feel like, and the museum. 10 houses, two shops, and a museum. What makes the most sense for us to have, like, the film set be one half of the island? Yeah. I feel like if we break the island down the center and we have one half of the island be the city, like where the detective's office is, similar to how we did the murder mystery where it was like the town and then like the mansion. Maybe we do that, but vertically, we could split it vertically. Like one half is the film set. One half is the city. That's where the detective's office is. And that's where their houses are. Like maybe unless... Should anyone live by the film set? Maybe Marlo. Okay, I think I have an idea. I think I have an idea. Let me get, let me get like a line down the center. Uh, da, 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 da. The janitor. <laughs> the janitor, you're right. How could I forget about uh, the lovely janitor? Okay. But put, to, but put it down the center, cool. So there's this. So this area is gonna be the film set and this area is gonna be the city, which I think make, makes more sense that resident services is in the city section. Maybe put the museum in front of the Ratwood. <gasps> Ooh, like the observatory, that's such a good idea. That's such a good idea. Yeah, I agree, I agree. Um, I don't have the Animal Crossing icons, so we're gonna use little fake icons, okay? We're gonna use little fake icons. So we'll put the museum back here. Like either either in front of it or behind it. Doesn't matter. Just as long as we get it, it things things always change because the terraforming is bigger or smaller. Um, but near it. You could also try to make the Chinese theater with the museum. I could. I feel like that would be hard though, doing it all in black and white. That might be hard doing it all in black and white. But I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. So we have this. Actually, I'd rather use um, a graphic that we could see better, hold on. Let's do this one. You could see that one a little bit better. We love Canva. <laughs> we love Canva. All right. Oh, no. Okay, great. The museum's there. Um, The shops, I think, should also be somewhere here. But I wanna figure out, like, the houses should, can you guys see my mouse? Yeah, right, you guys can see my mouse. I feel like the houses should be far away from the film set, except for Marlowe's. So maybe, I never do neighborhoods, but I feel like this kind of calls for a neighborhood to me. If it's gonna be a city, it's gotta call for a neighborhood, I think. So, let me get little house icons. Um, Let's do these. They kind of look like the Animal Crossing one. So let's do houses along the side here. Hey, we need a black and white star path. Oh my God, that's, yeah, like the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Abigail, don't, do not let me forget to do that. If I make it through this island and I don't do that, yell at me. That's a brilliant idea. That is a brilliant idea. Yeah, very that. Okay, that's such a good idea. That was such a good idea. Okay. So I feel like let's also be strategic about who's, you know, whose house is where. Who would live next to each other and who wouldn't? The houses are kind of like trailer parks where the stars hang out in between takes. Yeah. I feel like, oh, so, well, yeah. Yeah. They could still be on this side without it being... They could still be on this side without it being, um, yeah, yeah, I'm fine with that. That works. They can still be here and the film set can still be over there. Steph, oh my God, you guys are, <laughs> look at what you, I'm going to keep the screen up. Um, hi, welcome in. Jackie, hello, welcome in with the raid. Steph, thank you so much for being here. TJ, hello. Jazz, hello, welcome in. I hope you're doing so good. <laughs> I hope we're doing great. Welcome in, welcome in. How are you, how are you, how are you? 
Mask. Hello, welcome in. And Steph, hello. Guys, make sure you go check out Steph's channel if you haven't already. Welcome in. Steph, what were you up to tonight? Thank you so much for the raid. Silent Gamer, hello, welcome in. Um, all right, let me go to the let me go to the screen. Hi. Hi everyone. My name is Peyton. Welcome to the corner. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to see you. Today, we're working on my brand new island, which is an old Hollywood black and white crime story thing, all rodent version. And right now we're planning out the island. So we're trying to plan out what the map shape is going to be because I like to terraform um, crazy shapes into my islands. So that's what you're coming into. I hope you're doing good. Playing some Breath of the Wild. Let's go. I've never really done a full playthrough of it. Is it your first time playing it or is it like a, a new playthrough? I love your room. It's so colorful. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Thanks for popping in. Um, We're currently doing this. This is what I want to terraform my map into. A giant film clapper and a rat. And yeah, <laughs> we also already came up with the lore of the villagers I want, um, which was fun. We, we had a good time doing this. A new playthrough. I love Breath of the Wild. Let's go. I bet you're super excited for the new one to come out then. I bet you're pumped. I imagine. I imagine. Thank you for paying us a visit over here in the corner. Appreciate it so much. I appreciate it so much. Um, yeah, this is what we have going on. <laughs> Chaos. Chaos. So wait, let me put... Let me put Marlo's house on this side. I feel like Marlo lives in the back... He is producing the film. And maybe Flurry lives next to him. Maybe Flurry is over here too. Because she's his uh, Nepo baby niece. <laughs> I feel like maybe Flurry lives over here too. But not quite next to each other. Maybe some of them should live on that side. Maybe some of them should. Like maybe Greta should also live on that side. Because she's like the old Hollywood starlet. Maybe Greta lives, like, on top of the cheese. You know? I feel like, imagine Greta, like, having her own little place on top of the cheese. <laughs> and then, this makes sense for... I have their faces, too. I have their faces. Hold on. Um, Let me put their faces on which house is going to be theirs. That'll help my brain. Where are they? Where are they? Oh, I made this graphic so long ago. Oh, wait, sorry. <laughs> Marlo is the big cheese. Should I make another cheese here too? <laughs> Does that make it better? <laughs> Does that make it better? <laughs> this is such a creative theme. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I like to, um, I don't know. I like to make these things. I like to make weird things, you know. This is Marlo's house. Rose Crossing, thank you for being a member for four months. I appreciate it so much. Ooh, look what I got. I love you, Peyton. I just got a Zaylee the Bigfoot for from Five Below, and I love her. What does she look like? I know what the Bigfoots look like, but I don't know their names. I love that for you, though. Thank you for being a member for four months. Welcome, welcome in tonight. I hope you're doing good. I have the one. Oh, you, oh, you can see him. I have this guy. I like them. I don't have room. I want to be a Squishmallow person. I don't have the room. I need like a whole space. Hi, Brony Gamer. I'm doing good. How are you? Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing great. Um, and then Flurry goes here. Flurry goes here. And then... We need to do this for my... um library island we need to do this for my hard mode island because this is why i've gotten nothing done on that island is because i don't have a plan i'm the kind of person i need a plan otherwise nothing happens <laughs> if do you guys plan i'm curious do you guys plan out your islands do you use something to plan out your island or do you do you just do you just wing it because winging it is fine i have quite frequently just wung it but I don't know. I feel like when I when I do something like this, it's like kind of weird. I think it's easiest for my brain to plan it. Small sloths. Hello. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. What's up? What's up? Hope you're doing great. I think that Bella should have one of these houses in the front. I kind of like Bella being by the beach. Oh, or maybe on the peninsula. 
She's the writer. I think she needs like a scenic spot. I, th I think actually I want to do this. I want to do these start here and then like there's more back here. I think Bella goes right next to the peninsula. And who's Bella's neighbor? I think Petrie. I think Petrie and Bella are best friends. The writer and the special effects person. Yeah, they're buddies. You can't tell me otherwise. These guys are buddies. They're best friends. It is what it is. Um, I sketch out some main areas and then wing the filler spots. Yeah, I always it always ends up changing. Definitely. But I like to have some kind of plan. Um, I use graph paper for most of it. So you're detailed, detailed. I just, uh, I never know how big these things are going to be. And then I'm like, oh, I have no room or I have more room than I thought. Aren't my hard mode island, especially no planning. I have zero planning on that island, but I've gotten nothing done. So I think I need to do one of these streams for that island. <laughs> and then perhaps uh, I'll actually want to design it. Um, I feel like... For the lore, who else do we have? We've got Dora needs to live over here. Oh, the, where is the detective's office going to be? Shoot. That's important. Where is the detective's office going to be? It could be in the center, like here. Like the rat could be the, the detective's office next to the museum. Mm, I don't know. I kind of like the idea of the museum being up on a cliff and like it's like the Hollywood sign. So maybe the detective's office is like here, under the clapper, like here, like in the beginning. That could make sense for the lore. Like we come right into it. I kind of like that. Maybe we'll do, let's do that. I guess, let me look up like police station. Police station, detective's office. Yeah, let's like use this graphic. Yeah. What game is this? Um, so we're playing Animal Crossing, but right now we're just mapping out my island map on Canva. We're just mapping out my island on Canva. Um, and then if this is gonna be the case, then we need to have our detectives live behind this. So Walker and Raymond, I think, live behind it. Or like I don't know if they live in a line. I don't know if it's like. May, hello. How are you? I hope you're doing good. What's up? What's up? Hope you're doing well today. I mean, I guess one could technically live on the film set side. <gasps> Walker does. Walker lives on the film set side because he creeps around the film set because he wants to be a star. Easy. Got it. Easy. Got it. I'm doing good, May. I'm hoping you're doing good. You're doing good. I see it. You're doing great. Good. I'm glad you're doing great. You deserve to only ever be doing great. That's what I say. Maybe a hardened detective Raymond could relax on the beach. He, he needs to. He needs to relax on the beach. He's too strict. Why not make their houses the de their police department? Because I want to build an actual police department. Like an outdoor build that's the police department. Like how I did for the murder mystery place. Um, and I want it to be like a thing you can actually walk in. It'll be small though. And then like, yeah, they live next to it. And then they just live next to it. You know, you know? Walker wants to be a star, so he lives on the film set side. And Raymond lives here on the city side. Okay, so then we have to do, who else? Hamfrey? <laughs> Hamfrey, Dora, and Tasha. Okay, so perhaps Dora is in this vicinity as well. Perhaps Dora is here. And Tasha, I think, even though she is the star to be, I think she lives with these girls. I think she lives with these girls. I think that they're all, you know, they're all together. Because Tasha's a nobody. You know, Tasha's a nobody. She's going to be the star, but they don't know it yet. 
Um, going to head into lurk mode and get some dindin. Enjoy the rest of the stream. Thank you so much, Steph. Thank you for the raid. I appreciate it so much. Guys, make sure you go check out Steph if you haven't already. Please and thank you. And I appreciate it again. I hope you had a lovely stream. Random question. Did the 10K subs generate more members too? No, we lost like 150 members. <laughs> No, uh, we we had 400 members. We actually had we had 415. Now we're back to 310. So our goal by the end of the month is to just try to get back to 400. <laughs> just try to get back. And we've gotten a couple today because we were at 299 and now we're at 310. So thank you all for being members. Um, name the neighborhood Shatter Hills. I love that. I love that. And then where does Hamfrey go? Does Hamfrey need to be over here? I feel like Hamfrey needs to be over here then. I just saw the 10K before you said that. Congrats. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ghost, that wasn't an invitation. <laughs> Ghost! May was gifted, Small Sloths was gifted, Jessica was gifted, Carla was gifted, and Paige was gifted. Welcome to the Sloth Squad, everyone. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you for being here. Thank you for being Sloths. Make sure you say thank you to Ghost. Okay, this is math I can do. Now we're at 315. Now we're at 315. Thank you so much, Ghost. I appreciate it. We're making it, we've changed our goals because we fell like a little bit behind. Now. Since we already hit 400, we're still gonna do the member exclusive merch and the villager cosplay stream. But now to get the next milestone, it's just gonna be to hit 400. It's not gonna be to hit 450. So yeah, that's our next milestone. Thank you so, so much. I appreciate it so much. You didn't have to do that, but we do appreciate it. And welcome to the squad, everyone. We're glad you're here. We're so glad you're here. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being a slaw. Thank you for being a slaw. I appreciate you so much. Um, I think, I think Hamfrey the janitor should be like by himself somewhere, but I don't know where. If you were a janitor, where would you want to live? <laughs> does he live in the film set? Like, does he live like on the beach? You know? Does he live like on the beach by himself? Does he live on the secret beach? There's no room on the secret beach. I don't want him in the center of the map. He needs to live offset. So like, I don't know. Should he live on one of these beaches? You think he should live on the beach maybe? In the film set in the boiler room? Where is that though? Like in like here in the backpack? <laughs> like in the back corner? He lives on the trailer on the film set? There you go. All right, let's put him in the back. Let's put him in the back. Let's put him right here. That's fine. That's good. Oh, by the secret beach? So like here? <laughs> What's he doing over there? What's he doing over there? <laughs> okay. Marlo. Listen, that's not Marlo. That's Hamfrey. Hamfrey's there. Okay, so then these are all the houses, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, right? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, cool. So now we just need to place the um, shops. We need to do the shops and the campsite, which the the shops should definitely be on the right hand side. Um, I just don't know where. Oh my house! Oh my god! I forgot about my house. Where the heck am I gonna live? I always forget about my house. Yeah, shops by resident services. That's my go-to. It just, it is what it is. It is what it is, you know? Makes the most sense. I feel like just right here, just in a row with the houses, the shops. The campsite, I feel like should be on the beach. Or do you think the campsite should be in this, like a set? What if the campsite is a mini stage? What if the campsite is a mini stage? Because it's a platform. I think that could be cool. 
So maybe I'll put that somewhere in here. Um, let's do this as the campsite. Let's put it like, I don't know. Maybe close to the beach though. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Maybe close to the beach. I think the neighbor, I think move the neighborhood down and put the shops where the neighborhood is. You don't like Bella on the peninsula? You don't want Bella to be on the peninsula though? So like, maybe just, it could be like that. I want Bella to have her peninsula. And then I'll move these guys down. Because they can be quite close to each other. Okay. Do that. Okay. But Bella exactly on the peninsula? No, I want them to be next to each other. I want it to be like two and two. And then maybe we go like up an incline and then there's the other two. And then maybe we go up the incline and there's the shops or something like that. I don't know. I want to do something with inclines. I don't know what though. Are you using the in-game buildings even if they're matching the color scheme? I have to. I mean, I can't just put them on the beach. So I'm going to just try and cover them as much as I can and put like simple panels in front of them and try and make them look different. Um, but there'll be some color. But you know, just try to disguise it as something else kind of, I think. Campsite film set, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think. Oh, where? And then my house. My house. My house goes where? If I'm the camera operator, I don't want to be here. I want to keep this area open. I want to keep as much of this open as possible to make it intricate different sets. Um, I could be on the beach. I, I wouldn't hate being on the beach. Like if I'm like right here. Like welcome to the film set. And then like maybe my, maybe my area is like the green room. Maybe like my house is like the green room where we all can hang out. And there's like a mini stage there. Ables is a costume department. Ooh, that's a good idea. I put like all the kind of things they would wear in the movie outside. Be kind of a good idea. Be kind of a good idea. Oh, I need to fix this again. I thought I fixed this thing. It's fine. Um, okay. I like this. I think this is good. I think this is good. Will it happen? I think the hardest thing is going to be the cheese. I think the cheese is going to be hard for me. I think the mouse too. The clapper is going to be easy. Mm -mm. Clapper is going to be easy. The rat wood in the back, I think is so funny. We'll just kind of have to figure out how much we want to do inclines. Um, I don't think there's going to be like any water. This island is going to be all path, but I want there to be like different levels. I don't think there's going to be any water. So I think all of these designs are going to be laid out in path that will cover with in-game path. It'll be very city-esque. Everything will be black and white. And yeah, this is going to be good. I think this is going to be good. Um, and then we are coming to the end, so I'm not gonna do this. I just was gonna put like pictures of different items that I could use here, but I can I can do that on my own, to be honest. Um, I think this stuff was the more fun part anyway. So yeah, um, maybe for the last couple minutes, we'll do a few more tickets while we close out the stream. But I'm really excited for this island. Thank you guys so much for planning the lore with me. Of course, it'll develop as we go along. And as we go along, just like last time for the murder mystery, I'm not gonna tell you who the killer is gonna be, but as you, as we get through the island, give me your suspicions on who you think is the killer, okay? All right, all right, all right. Um, I put some list, the list is huge that Nat put. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I can't wait to check. I can't wait to check. I'm gonna make a, I already made a Pinterest page, but I didn't put anything on it yet. So I can't wait. Thank you so much. That's gonna help me out because then we can, um, just like start going. You just start going with this one. I'm so excited. Okay, um, let's get back to the game. Let me close this. Okay, so yeah, let's just do some more hunting for the last couple little bits. I think everyone has a motive, even more so than last time. I think you can, 
you can wonder why every single villager did it for this one. It's gonna be fun. Animal Crossing is so fun. <laughs> Animal Crossing is fun! Oh my god, I love it. It's good, it's good. It's good. Oh, let me pull my YouTube stuff back up. I'm like, why does the screen feel weird? Because you didn't pull your YouTube thing up. Oh my god, my YouTube is so behind. Thank you guys, we have almost 200 likes on the stream, by the way. Thank you so much. If you haven't already liked today's stream, I would appreciate it so much. I would appreciate you so much. All the appreciation. Oh, and it's telling me the member number is wrong. Wait, the member number is wrong? Oh, the member number is one off. Okay. So we actually have 316. So thank you guys so much. Appreciate it so much. Wait, Pei, can we temporarily make the detection? What do you mean? Can we temporarily make the detection? What does that mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Uh, and when you're talented like Peyton always looks good. Shut up. No, stop him. Detective, sloth, black and white. Oh, yes. I can do that. I can do that. I can. I can and I can, I can, I can. Um, congrats on 10K subs, by the way. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Is this a remix of Celestial? Um, I think that song was. This is a lo-fi Nintendo variety playlist. I don't know what the last song was because I don't have it open. But I can get it open. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. <laughs> yes, it was. Thank you, guys. 190 likes. Appreciate it so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and yeah, I'm streaming bright and early tomorrow morning as well. So there isn't that long between the streams. <laughs> there isn't that long between the first two streams of the week. But then the last stream of the week is on Friday. So a little bit more of a gap. But you'll get me all, not all day tomorrow, but for a uh, little bit tomorrow. Be back tomorrow. We'll be back, back, back again tomorrow. I'd love to find one of the dreamies before we end, but maybe I'm just too greedy. Ugh. Not a hippo. Yikes. I'm hoping Hamfrey gets booted from my island today as I have a campsite visitor. Well, you can... You can close the game. And then they'll give you a different person that they want to kick out if it's not him. And do that. Or just yell at him. Be like, Hamfrey, get out. Come to Peyton's Island instead. Be like, come to Peyton's Island instead. She wants you to be the janitor on the black and white island. <laughs> also, I don't know what the name of this island is going to be. The name is always Potato Park, but I like to always think of a name that's like a um, alliteration. So we had Murder Manor was our last one. We've had Boogie Bay. We'd Lava Lagoon. Um, left to fix up and realize I was gifted a sub. Yes, you were gifted by Ghost. Welcome in, welcome in. Welcome to the squad. Welcome to the squad. I appreciate you so much. Soul paint, you can have them. Perfect. <laughs> Rodent Ridge. <gasps> Kelsey, that's such a good idea. Rodent Ridge. That's a good idea. Oh, Ratwood Regency. <laughs> I'm not the rodents. <laughs> Poor Walker and uh, Raymond. The only non-rodents in town. They're here to catch the rodents. Hi, Naru. Welcome in. I hope you're doing so good. What's up? What's up? The name of the island is the name of the movie. Oh, true. Rodent Manor. The prequel to Murder Manor. The prequel. And then I want to make this island into a game too. So like how the Murder Mystery Island had a game for you to solve. I want to do the same thing. But on this island. Hi Star Power. Welcome in. Nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Thank you for being here. Welcome to the corner. Hope you're doing so very good today. Hope you're doing great today. Hope you're having a nice day. I hope you're having a good day. I want to 
eat after the stream. Am I hungry? Do I, am I hungry for like a meal or do I want a snack? Because I only had like a big meal at lunch. I didn't technically have dinner tonight. The lunch was big enough. Hazel, what a baby. I also have a frosty from Wendy's though. I could just have the frosty. Or do I want to eat an actual meal at 9.30 p.m.? Decisions, decisions. <laughs> Your voice is beautiful. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you so very much. All right. We've got 80 tickets. We've got a couple more minutes. Do we think we can realistically find one of these villagers in a few minutes? What was the Murder Mysteries Island name again? Murder Manor. Murder Manor. All I've had today is some chips and dip, some chips and dip and some pie. <laughs> that's not enough, but that's not enough. You just finished lunch? What time is it? What time is it? Hi Tia, I'm doing good, how are you? Hope you're doing good. Potato Dog, that's a fun name. I'm about to have some chocolate ice cream. Sounds good. Sounds good. Chips and dip is not enough. <laughs> What kind of pie though? What kind of what kind of pie was it? What kind of was apple pie? What kind of pie. Twelve twenty uh, six p.m. here in Australia. It is the afternoon. It is the afternoon. It's the evening here. It's late. It's almost bedtime. <gasps> it, it's Tipper again. I thought it was Portia. I was like, oh my god, another dog. Caramel apple walnut pie. And where can I get some? <laughs> Ooh, murder in monochrome. I like the monochrome in the name. That's a good name, Ghost. You guys are so good. Why are you guys so good at this? Try strawberry wafer cookies. Ooh, where can I get those? That sounds good. And I'm getting this from where? Where am I getting this from? Sounds delicious. Oh, I clicked the wrong button. Ooh. Yeah, I would like that. You're so positive with your positivity. I bet you'll find a dreamy. Oh, thank you, Potato Dog. I was so greedy, though, because on the last stream, we found three of them in one in one go. So, like, it, it makes sense we didn't find one today. BFF Animal Crossing. Thank you so much for four months of being a Slot Squad member. Love you, Pay. All the love. All of us gone for what would I miss? Did you miss us um, planning out the island on Canva? We like made all of the characters and the map. Maybe that. And now we're villager hunting for the last few minutes. Safe ways for us. I don't have a safe way. Or do you mean US? <gasps> Chadwick! You're on my other island. You Chadwick, baby. We don't have, I don't have safe way. I know it's a grocery store have one though oh i was here for that oh okay then yeah just hunting for villagers last few minutes the last few minutes we're gonna hunt for some villagers and then yeah i don't know what we're gonna do tomorrow i'm not gonna lie i had a i had a plan for tomorrow's stream but i don't know if i want to do what i had planned now for tomorrow's stream this is why some streamers i love i love them i love them and all the power to them i cannot be this person when some people, when they post out their weekly schedule, they'll write in like Tuesday stream and then like what the stream is gonna be. I can't do that. Cause I can't make a commitment. Cause I changed my mind last minute too often. I changed my mind. I can't be like, yes, tomorrow is gonna be X, Y, Z thing. And then I wake up that day and I'm like, no, it's not. <laughs> like, no, it's not. It's not gonna be that thing. I can't do it. I forgot to say the last weekend we performed The Wizard of Oz in my local theater as my first show. Oh my goodness. The show only ran for two days, but we performed for over a thousand people. That's amazing. What's making you change your mind on tomorrow's stream? Um, I was gonna play a new game on stream. I'm debating making it, not Klaus. <laughs> oh, not Klaus. Uh, I'm debating making video content on the, the game I was gonna stream instead. I don't know though, cause I have a couple other games I need to make videos about. So I was gonna split it up and stream at least one new game this week, but I don't know. I don't know if I want to. 
I might just want to do Animal Crossing tomorrow. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. I don't know. I'll decide after the stream. In, in the 10 minutes after the stream before I go to bed, I'll decide. Do I want to avoid ACNH? No, no. I, like, want to play Animal Crossing. It just would help me out if I don't have to make, like, five videos this week. Mm, I don't want to do hard mode tomorrow at 8 a.m. <laughs> I don't want to do hard mode tomorrow at 8 a.m., though. That's the only thing. Because I don't have enough time between now and tomorrow stream to plan anything. I don't know yet. We'll see. I'll decide. I'll decide after the stream. I'll decide after the stream before I go to bed. Maybe I will do what I had planned. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I never know. I never know. Never know. Rear view ridge, a play on rear window. Ooh. Ooh. What's this? It's cat. Cat. I don't dislike cat. I, I think I've been hard on cat in the past, but she's actually kind of fine. All right, let's do two more. Let's go to 85 tickets. Let's go to 85 tickets. Why not just play some demos? I only like to do that if it's a longer stream. If it's like a six hour one, for sure. But tomorrow's won't be a six hour. It'll because I work tomorrow. Tomorrow is 8 a.m. to 12.30. So that's 9, 10, 11, 12. That's four and a half hours tomorrow. I don't know yet. We'll see. I'll we'll figure it out. I'll make decisions. I'll make decisions. So, uh, Safeway is basically Albertson. I don't have Albertson either. I don't have Albertson either. What about a stream like this one for the library? Maybe. I don't know if I want to do that back to back though. I don't know if I want to do it back to back though. I don't know. And then there's less to plan out for that one because we're not like come up. We're not really, well. We have to pick like what the villagers stuff is, like what their book genre is. But we don't have to. We don't have to make that many decisions. We just have to think about like the map placement. I don't know. My hard my hard mode island stresses me out. <laughs> my hard mode island stresses me out. So I might wait until Friday stream to do that, just so I can pre-plan some things. Because I need to have something else to do as well. Because I won't take the whole time. And I got nothing else to do. Yeah, I don't know. I'll think, I'll think about it after the stream. I might just do something completely different. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Peyton, 10 minutes from now, we'll know. <laughs> Peyton, Peyton, 10 minutes from now, we'll know. But mm, I don't know yet. <laughs> After I eat something, my brain will be cleared. And I'll be like, what are you going to... It's hard to predict what I'm going to want to do in the morning. But I, I know Peyton at 7 a.m. tomorrow when she wakes up. I don't want to create too much stress for her. <laughs> I don't want to create too much stress for her. <laughs> uh, what about Bayonetta? Oh, I loved that game so much. I think I was the only one, though. <laughs> I loved Bayonetta so much. I've been playing it off stream. I don't think I could stream it again, though. I I don't know if I could stream it again, though. Hornsby. Okay, one more. One more. One more. Ask Dexter what he wants to play. Dexter wants to play... Dexter wants me to find my DS and play Nintendogs. So he could see all the cute dogs. All right, one more for good luck. Uh, Bayonetta is better to play than it does to stream. Um, it's not that I didn't like streaming it. It's like not the usual type of game I played. So I know that most people want to see me do other stuff. And I don't want to just do stuff that I think people want to see me play. But also, um, I loved that stream. I had so much fun. And I have been, I have been playing it though off stream. And it's hard to commentate on it. It's hard to commentate on it because it's so new to me. So I didn't. I feel like I didn't talk as much, um, and I also it just it didn't do as good too. Like let's be honest, it didn't really do that good. I didn't care though. I was having the time of my life. 
Um, but I've progressed quite a bit off stream, so I'd have to be like, this is what all the stuff, this is all the stuff that happened. What's on my shirt? Linus from the Peanuts. Linus from the Peanuts. All right, this is our final island. Who's it gonna be? Oh, I thought the door opened. I was like, hello. Um, who's, oh, the front door opened. Who's it gonna be? Our final island, it's someone orange. It's Chief. Okay, cool. Well, everyone, it was so early. Wait, what was early? What was early? What day are we on in the game? Just so I can not autofill by accident again. I've autofilled by accident so many times. Do I have screenshot space? No. Hold on, let's delete a screenshot really quick. Let's delete a screenshot really quick. And uh, look at all my, look at all my ooblets. Oh, the Bayonetta stream was early. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Um, I can probably get rid of, look at this cute little picture of Molly. Oh my God, remember when I used to do interior designing? <laughs> remember when I used to do interior design all the time? Okay, wait, sorry. Wait, 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 what day? It's the 9th. I wanna take a picture, but this is the only way I not autofill my plots is if I take a screenshot of the date. Okay, cool. All right, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out. Appreciate it so much. Uh, let me go to this. Oh my goodness. Thank you guys so much for the insane amount of love today on today's stream. This isn't the 10K celebration. It's gonna be next week. Hopefully when I have a day, I could stream super long. Um, Cause I didn't, I didn't anticipate to celebrate 10K this week. So we're gonna do it next week. Um, but thank you all for the love anyway. We had 17 new members on today's stream. So thank you so much. I appreciate it. Especially because we, you know, we lost some friends, but that's okay. It's all right. Thank you all for gifting. It, it's just, it's, you never have to do it. Um, but it is so very appreciated. So thank you so much. Thank you to the new subscribers. Thank you to everyone whose uh, first stream this was. Thank you. Thank you to the raiders. Had so many raids. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you to the other content creator friends who popped in the chat. Um, yeah, thank y'all for being here. I don't know if anyone else is still streaming, but let's find out. Thank you for helping me plan the island too. Um, yes, people are streaming. Um, and then like I said, I will be back tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. I don't know what we're gonna do, but we're gonna do something. We're gonna do something. Okay, um. Showing up on the first page. Not me getting an ad. How long has this person been going? Are they gonna go for longer? I, I'm like the queen of coming in at the end of people's streams. Do they look, they look busy. They look busy. They look busy, okay. Um, let's go raid our friend Gothrock Fairy. And Gothrock is getting so close to 1.5K. So if you have not already subscribed, well, what if you did that? I'm gonna do a redirect, but I'm also gonna put the link in the chat. Do hashtag Peyton's Corner Raid. Send love, not spam. Andy, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for being a sloth. Um, and Goth is also playing Animal Crossing tonight. Looks like doing some work, doing some work on the island. And yeah, thank you guys for hanging out. Go over there. Hashtag Pants Corner Raid. Love, not spam. Go subscribe. Go like. Go be cool. Also, we're four likes away from 200. So if you haven't liked the stream, like it on the way out. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning doing something. Um, and yeah, all the love again. Thank you for helping us hit 10K. I appreciate it so much. I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye-bye. <laughs>